Yo, what's up, guys? How you doing? I'm, I'm actually quite excited that I was able to uh, stream this because I was very, very disappointed I wasn't able to play it over the weekend. But they extended it for another day. So we get to sit and stream it today. Oh. Yeah, you know what sucks, though? It's like you can't really party up with anyone. So it's just totally random who you play with. Um, I played one game so far, just to obviously see how it was running on my PC. So, I played one game of Victim, but <laughs> I did terrible, I think. I know. I was playing very sneaky, but I still I still got killed. I was disappointed. And yes, I am playing on controller. I am not playing keyboard and mouse. But, uh, I mean, I've had times watching, um, watching some people stream it and stuff, so I kind of know what I do, but still don't really understand, and the tutorials aren't fantastic. I'd, I'd rather have a tutorial that I can play through, and then I can understand it a bit better, but, um, yeah, I mean, it's all a learning curve at the end of the day. We'll, we'll get there. How you doing, Ray? Dustin? Sporter? Two skulls? Uh, I can't, I can't remember, I can't remember your actual name before. Cause you changed your name. What's up, Chad? Tammy? Excited for this game release. Could not come any sooner. It's uh, only a couple of months, luckily. Hopefully, we get a, like a console beta as well. Oh, two seconds before I before I start playing. Change my chat. Put a poll for us to pick what you play. I mean, I'm just gonna rotate between them both. Um, like, I, I don't really mind playing family, if it's both team-based, but, um, we'll start... Oh, there's a fucking fly. Kill it. We'll start with, um... We'll start with some victim, we'll move to family, we'll go back to victim, etc. How do I feel? I, I don't know. Like, I put in my post, I was like, um... Should I... Like, I, I don't know, I'm, I'm a bit, a bit skeptical of the gameplay loop. Like, not being as entertaining as Evil Dead, but we'll have to see. That Avengers cap is clean. I, I bought it on the weekend. In Tesco. <laughs> Let me know if the game audio is um, loud enough, because... Oh, if it's too loud, I'll, I'll turn it down. Oh, I'm playing as Anna again. <laughs> I got Anna last time. And, yeah, I don't really know their abilities or anything. Each character has unique abilities. Lock and craft unique skill sets. And there's loads of cosmetics, look at that. More cosmetics than Evil Dead, guys. We're already doing, we're already doing well. So what, what's, um, what's Anna's ability? It's a little loud, but turn it up a tad bit. What? You think the gameplay loop is good? Like, can I, can I hover over and see their abilities or anything? Leland and Connie are the strongest. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, like, I pressed my ability in the game, but I wasn't sure what it actually did. <laughs> and there's, like, nowhere to really see what it does. Yeah. It's very, very minimal tech test. Not very open anyway. I never, t I never turned it down. At all. I never, I never touched the sound at all. <laughs> Leon can knock the family down and their asses throwing them. I seen that with his like uh, shoulder barge like ability. But does Anna like sense things? I'm looking at that, and I think Con Connie can like instantly pick locks or something, right? Oh, so Anna's a tank for taking temporary damage. She can tank a lot of damage with her ability. Oh, okay. So if I'm about to get attacked, I should trigger her ability, right? To me, like looking at the the icon, to me it looks like something that will see your surroundings type of thing. So then you can see where there's like uh, you know like the loot, like the the toolboxes and the health. Oh, there's definitely more characters, Sporter. Um, I think Sissy on the family side is supposed to be in the game. Um, I think there's actually a screenshot of her. 
And th there's a bunch of other survivors that haven't made it into the tech test, so... Leland is very good for taking care of yourself, okay. Five killers and five survivors went Oh, so the only... There's only one more survivor coming. Like, uh, at launch. Why I, I... I haven't really had a t chance to play Rochi. I, I said I played one game as Anna before my stream just to see if it was working okay. <clears throat> Julie? Oh, yeah, so Julie's the other survivor, and then... Is it sissy on the family side? Should be interesting, we'll see. Different different type of paced game, I think. Been a while since I've played a sort of like hide and seek game. Last one was probably his DVD. <laughs> Over a year ago since I've played DVD though. Oh, so there's two survivors. Wait, so there's gonna be six survivors at release. Game has been huge on Twitch, that's where they extended the playtests. Mate, is there a Memorial Day in the States or something as well? Someone was saying. This guy is not ready enough. Uh, you know what? I did stealth, Arcanist. I stealthed, I got outside, and then um, the fucking cook found me, even though I was just crouched around, not moving or anything. I was being very sneaky. I had Bubba on me at the <laughs> straight away as well. Yeah, um, if there's any issues with the audio or anything, guys, just let me know, okay? Because I, I I don't stream from PC much. I turned it down quite a bit, but it might still be too loud. Um, I think she might start with a bone shard. I'm not sure. No, uh, I don't have anything. I did have a bone shard, yes. Um, I was cutting down, like, the, the sound maker things and stuff. Right. Definitely gonna need a mic for this game. What is this place? I don't know about that. We got too loud. This, goes. this this girl's voice reminds me of um Oh, what's her name? Is it Kimiko or something from World War Z? Oh shit. See if we can find something. But yeah, if it, like I said, if there's any issues with the gameplay or audio, just let me know. Get a bone shard. So am I not allowed to touch like the sound bit? Or if it starts flashing red, does that mean I've made noise? This will be the next game after Evil Dead. There we go. We got a bone shard. <clears throat> I did. I did pretty well on my first uh, chase, though, from Leatherface earlier. I'll say that. If you tap tap too fast, it shows every family. Member. Yeah, I'm. So I'm saying, I because it highlights like it going red on the sound. I don't know if that means I'm making noise or you know I can go to a certain point. Can we go through here? Use fuse box. Oh, you get the fuse box. I think I'd rather just go and uh, try and find a tool and pick the lock, to be honest. Very dark game, isn't it? I don't think I got this map earlier. I think I got the, the new map they added. Yeah, this really does sound like her from uh, World War Z. I wonder if it is. Someone just chilling on the hook. Why I? I'll unhook you. I've got borrowed time. Wait, wait, wait. This is like a fucking maze, man. Go to bro. Heal friend. I'm just uh, shoving this bottle in his ass. I healed him. Oh, shit. Bro, it's so dark down here. I can't see anything. Should have upped my gamma a bit, I think. This guy's like not moving. Bubba's here. Oh shit. 
Bubba's behind me. Run. 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 Get in that. Let me just uh, close this door real quick. An yeah, AFK farming in the technical tests. Crazy. Ooh, look at this fucking room. Well, I've got a bone shard, but I feel like we need to find a screwdriver or something. Oh, hang on. Something over here. Let's check it out. Oh shit. I kill it. Oh. I've been executed. Oh, that was the AFK guy. Oh yeah, that's the guy that didn't um kill the chicken. Oh shit. Well, I think he's know where I am in anyway. Yeah. So I'm guessing in here there's a tool. Oh. Oh but can we talk about this? I think I pressed my ability at the right time there. Wait, talk about this. Oh. Nope. Let me just uh, get through here real quick. I know, I'm, I was trying to get that tool there. L last time I played, I found one straight away, which is really handy. So I could get out the basement. But, um... It's the only one I've seen so far. Hey, we found some health, which is good. Pour that on my ass. There we go. Alright, we got some health. Shit. Bubba's right there. Alright, we're back in this room, so I think we can try and get the tool again. Last couple of days, order food over the phone. It's always like pulling teeth out, you can't hear them properly. <laughs> you just eat. I go in person. There's someone who can search really fast, right, without making any noise. I'm not sure who that is, though. Evil dead characters are showing a lot of skin. <laughs> it's Connie. I think she can like search for stuff really quick without making noise, which is I think pretty good. Alright, we got the unlock tool. Now we just need to find the door. And get the hell out of the basement. Uh, yeah, so I think when your heart goes down, you start like um, you start like losing losing health. Someone made noise over here. Oh shit! Someone's getting someone's getting grappled over there. <laughs> Oh man, I don't have a bone shard. Uh, some health. Might as well carry it. <clears throat> oh, there's a bone shard. Let's get one. Man, I got up the basement like so much faster the first time I played. I mean, it was a bit easier to find it on the other map. Like the, I literally got a, I got a screwdriver and then just picked the lock straight away. Wish I could have played, but I'm waiting for release. I was very good because like I just been so busy this weekend. I just didn't have the time to play. Oh, someone DC'd. Alright. How do we swap? Oh, yeah, left on the D-pad. Oh, what happened to my um Can I not get my screwdriver back? Bro, what? That sucks. It swapped the, the screwdriver that I fucking got. Now I'm gonna have to find another one. Can 
Grandpa level 2. Keep still. AFK player didn't help with this match. I, I kind of feel like I've been the only one sort of doing the stuff. I mean, I think someone's upstairs, though. I'm guessing someone's opened up a... Opened up a door somewhere. I, know. I mean, I think I'll be alright once I learn the, uh... Oh, shit. They're all upstairs and I'm the last one alive. <laughs> Oh, is it, did someone open this door in here? <laughs> Alright, we're gonna we're gonna shank him. We're gonna shank him all. Oh shit. I didn't know there was a trap. Nope. Nope. I'm just gonna run. I'm by myself in any way, so why not? Where the fuck am I? Drop down, please. <laughs> that fall, though. <laughs> run. Oh, shit. Just trap myself in here, bro. Well, I mean, what can I do? I'm by myself, man, and I had an AFK guy, so that was off to a great start, wasn't it? Bro, why? Why? I want to know why was there? A, um, why the fuck was there a ladder going into just a dead end? That sucks. Terrible. Look at them carries, man. I was top of the team. These guys did absolutely... I got two DCs and one person died. So, yeah, that was that was great. I but it was a it was a door that you have to pick the lock on the other side pretty much. So, it was a door out of the basement, which is why I thought it was a bit weird how it's a door out of the basement, but you go through another door and it drops you down into there. <clears throat> Yeah, it, it keeps putting me as Anna. I have no idea why. Maybe I'm going to have to be an Anna main. Well, they copied the Evil Dead loading screen with the chainsaw. <laughs> what else are they going to use? <laughs> why I, lad? The dev's done a little trolling. With what? Oh, with, with designing that? Pretty funny. Friday the 13th game stream? Never. I tried playing Friday the 13th ones, I did not like it. Do you think playing family gives you a better understanding of the game? How are you doing, Glory? How do you feel about our first few moments with TCM? I mean, when I've been hanging in streams and stuff, it's been, uh... It's been fun to watch. So, I mean, I sort of understand some things. It, the problem is, when you're watching someone stream, it's, like, totally different to playing it, because you, you can learn some stuff, but you don't always digest all the information very well. Oh, that was literally my second match, Glory. I've only played two games. I, I, I know, like, majority of what the family does. Like, Cook obviously listens out for survivors, but he, he runs a bit slower. Uh, Hitchhike is obviously the type of guy that, you know, leaves traps around and primarily is to, like, uh, perimeter check, especially around the front of the house with, like, the generator and stuff. So I know, I know quite a bit so far. I know overall wins. I, I wouldn't be surprised if I don't escape at all today. Neelan can stun Leatherface. But it's really fun. Let's get out of here, man. Thank you, Lord. 
Okay. Oh, we got a Leland that's playing this time, so... We're already, we're already doing better than last game. And yeah, this searching takes a while when you don't want to make any noise. <laughs> Right, we got it. Go through this crack. And now let's look for a tool. I should see what that is. Found a tool. Sound like there was someone behind me. Yeah, th this is. I think this is the first from the first game I played. This is like the sort of route I went, and I got a tool straight away. I've survived for one minute. I've done well. I'm proud of myself. So that's Julie there. Um, I'm not. No. I, oh, the one that's hanging up. Maybe. Yeah. Like the the blonde one. I think. Oh, I hear Bubba's chainsaw. <gasps> Ooh. That's health. Something we don't need yet. Oh shit. You can do this. Think. This man sprinting through things, making noise. Please don't, please don't come near me, please. <clears throat> Wasn't me made no who made noise. We'll find the guy who did. Yes. <coughs> oh. Did I lose them? The door's right here. Yeah, where's it? There we go. Lock picking simulator. Guys, we're gonna get out of the basement. Didn't even get out last time. But we sort of did. And then it straight back up into it. Come on, come on. So, I don't think it's wise to run straight up, is it, once you've opened the door? Because the door makes noise, isn't it? Noises of waking grandpa. Leland got detected there. Alright. We out. Yeah, so now, now I need to, um... Tinderella escaped the basement. <laughs> what a name. Crawl through here. And here is Chainsaw Man. What's that over there? Ooh. Found the valve handle, nice. I couldn't find that last time. Shit. Wait, what's that thing that's highlighted, chat? Down there. Is that why I've got to take the valve handle to? So if I find a well to go into the basement. Yeah, what up, Leland? How you doing, bro? You just chilling back here? I, I, I can't get past this guy. I don't have any health, sorry. You need healing, I can't help you there. That's the gas tank? Okay. Well, I'm gonna go back down. Um, is it, is it... Yeah, I know, I know it's open to the escape. So, to, is that in the basement? So I've gotta go back down in the basement. Yeah, it's not in like a different area. I need that urban evasion in my life. It's in the basement, okay. So it should be, like, through this way, I think. A shortcut? Furnace tunnel. Why I, lad? Yeah, okay. 
can't see where it is now. Basement is big good luck. <laughs> Maybe it was down here? Is there nothing down here? What's that? So dark. Oh, it's like a little crawl hatch. Um, sport, I think this is the new map. So this is why I think it looks a bit different. Unless you've seen the new map before. Tinderella got executed, guys. Yeah, bro, I legit can't find this fucking, uh... Can't find this thing. Latch the door. Is it in here? Oh, is this it? No? I would have thought that was it. Turn on requires... What's this? Oh, it's a light. Hey, I can see. Oh, there's that. Oh, it requires a tool to um, trap it. Yeah, is this not the thing? In God's name, what is this place? At front gate, don't have a key. Someone typed there. Yeah, I don't know. I'm completely lost. Uh, trying to find this fucking. Gas tank. <clears throat> oh, shit, that makes a lot of noise. It's a timed exit, escape, you activate it, run to the exit, and close it in a specific time. <laughs> Funny thing is, I'm not going to know where the exit is, but uh, hopefully I'll get someone else out, right? Surprise on maintenance by putting a new map in the game, add new mechanics for Levis Face to carry a carry and hook a victim. Oh, it's just like DVD. People will be getting camped now, huh? Camped on the hook. You guys are probably kicking yourselves right now, trying to find this gas tank, and you probably know where it is, and I'm just like, being a total dumbass and there's probably ran by it. Yeah, I don't know, I feel like I've been around the whole, the whole place and I just can't find, like, I thought it was this. Like, I don't know. Sort of looks similar to what I've seen on the highlighted aura. How am I liking the game? I mean, I'm just learning the map and stuff. You're lost as hell as well. <laughs> well, I'm glad I'm not the only one lost. <laughs> like, I, I keep finding this door here, but, um... I mean, that's just to go upstairs, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, that's just to go upstairs. Actually, I don't need to go... I don't know how I feel about the auto crouch. I might turn that off. Yeah, I gotta keep like uncrouching myself just to do a little jog around. But yeah, it's like I've been in a whole circle and I just can't see this fucking gas tank anywhere. Yo, what up, Dutch Masters? How you doing? Hey, Bob, uh, you can sort of fight back, so I have a shiv right now that you can shiv uh, a family member. Well, this, this area looks kind of important. Maybe it's in here. It's hard to find stuff on this game. Yeah, well, I mean, we got the aura for it before, and it definitely said it was down here. And 
it was like... This guy, I have three on me. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I'm terrible, okay? I'm trying to help. I know, ga gas tank to me would be like a furnace. But I, I am like literally so fucking confused. I, d I don't think it's down here, you know. I, I, I think it's d in a different, like, there's got to be, like, a different fucking area. Like, a different basement area. There's no way it's down here. I can hear the cook. The bloody cook. Because this is, like, the only thing I've found that looks, like... Remotely close to a gas tank. We got one other person alive. They have 1,325 points though. I mean, I think once she learns where things are, it's definitely not going to be an issue like playing this game. This door is open. The aura should be displayed constantly. Note to the devs. Oh, you know, give it so we can actually, like, see it now and then. Person just got executed, bro. I feel like I'm letting the team down. I've, I've, uh, I don't know. If I found that gas tank, probably just could have opened it and we could have got some escapes, but... Yeah, it's pretty crazy. How we just couldn't find it. Something flashing red over there. <clears throat> What's that? A gate? I believe they're a, they're a boiler there. Yeah, I mean, I went through the other side and I've... And I found it, but... Um, let's open this up. I showed the aura of the gas tank in the basement, so I went down, and I went around the whole basement and could not find it at all. I'm being a sneaky little survivor right now. I'm gonna get this unlock tool, and maybe I can get out somewhere else. But uh, my, my heart's uh, low right now. It's somewhere in the basement. It's just a maze. Maybe we need a new method of finding it. Yeah, I mean, it should like um, maybe highlight the aura of it a couple of times. Not just one time for about 10 seconds. Bro, you did not know I'm here. There's no way. <laughs> the safe to move. No, I'm gonna have to, I, keep, I can't move yet. <laughs> <laughs> Silly bubba. Alright, I've I've screwed it screwed up a few bubbas in my lifetime. 
Go, 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 go. Yeah, so I think... I think this gate is actually done by the pressure valve, right? I don't think I can open that. Like this one here. Overload pressure valve to open. Yeah, so that that's the one that's done by the gas tank. Imagine I got out of this. The graphics is tough. Do you, do you like the graphics or do you think they look bad? I've got it on ultra 1080p right now. I think, like, the design doesn't look terrible. I don't think it's as visually, like, appealing as, um... As, uh, Evil Dead. Definitely not. It looks good, but it's definitely not Evil Dead level of graphics, I'll say that. Rampart Maximum doesn't know where to hide. Go, go, go. Oh, my tool broke. No. <laughs> Alright, I'm a professional DVD player. I'm a professional DVD player, don't worry. <clears throat> I'm not going down without a fight, boys. You're about to be detected by Grandpa. Yeah, no shit. <clears throat> I think we could have got out of this one if the basement wasn't such a fucking maze. And I was able to actually find the, uh... Find that gas tank, man. We would have been long gone. See it, chump. I found it! I found it! Go, 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 go! Okay. Who cares? Do it! <laughs> Fucking run! Oh, no. Run! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Through that. Climb. Oh, no. Come on, get up. <laughs> get up, get up, come on. We got to go, man. Just fucking sprint. Oh, bro, I'm like blocked in over here. Ah, fuck off, Bubba. Fuck off, Bubba. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. get in there. <laughs> oh my god, man. Run, please. I'm almost there. I think. No, he's gonna kill me. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Through that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, 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 go. Run! Why is it not open? Should it not be open? Oh, I, I, I already did that. What? Oh, did it run out of time? Are you fucking serious, bro?
It's about to open. No. Are you kidding me? Bro, I don't know where the fuck I've gone. I can use that shit. Come on. Oh, where the... This dude had no audio, man. Oh, come on. <laughs> Out of nowhere. He just snuck up on me. I tried, man. I was close. So wait, so you've got to wait for that open. So if... That's kind of... I don't know. That's kind of shitty. Yeah, it's kind of shitty. I thought, like, as soon as you turn the valve, it would open. Then you've got a time to get there. I, I will give Killer a go. I want to get one victim escape and we'll hop on, uh, on the family side. How was the game then? It's pretty good. It's just, uh, yeah, trying to learn where shit is <laughs> can be a bit of a pain in the ass. I learned a bit of the map a little bit there, though. Like, I, I, I kind of knew where I was running to, at least. I didn't get completely lost once I found the, uh, the gas tank. I was able to kind of just sprint straight for it. See you, Sab. Have a good one. I'm playing as Sunny now. Is Sunny any good? Oh, it builds pressure, then releases pressure. Shit. Well, when someone said it was timed, I thought it was like I had to fucking run straight for it. Like, I thought it opened up straight away. Well, now I know. I think if I ran there, I mean, I wouldn't have been able to hide in anyways. Because uh, cause of Grandpa being like a higher level. <clears throat> It'll highlight when it opens. Okay. He'll keep DC when it gets sunny. Is he that bad? He's like the scout. Oh, so he can like find things. What what does his ability do? The hell? A like, full team joined and then left. I picked nice cap, changing it up a bit reminds me of the Camelot baseball movie. What? <laughs> it's a fucking Avengers hat. I mean, I haven't really played much of the game to know about the balancing of it yet. I've heard there's some cheesy stuff on Survivor though, with like the loops and things. Um, people like breaking instantly through the window to escape and stuff. Uh, if people don't know their, like, their roles on the killer side, but I wouldn't necessarily say that's a balancing thing. That's more like people not really doing their job correctly on Hitchhiker. I know, I know, I did realize that when he got max level. I got, uh, I kept getting detected with the yellow aura. He kept crashing. Oh, luckily I haven't had any crashes yet, and it seems to be running pretty smoothly for me. People do see when they get Sonny or the cook. Well, this is the first time I'm playing Sonny, so... We'll see what happens. I don't know the point of this cutscene at the start. It's not... It's not like it's a helpful... I think it's a helpful tip. Why am I hung upside down? Rude. Oh, felt that, felt that right on the back. Yeah, so what, what, what does this guy's uh, ability do? Holy shit.
shows where the killers are if they are making noise. Uh, you know his like active ability here. So if I press, oh yeah, so if I press like RB, it'll uh, it'll give me it. Get a bone shard. Let's go, Sunny Jim. <clears throat> His ability makes some kind of required comms if you want to make the most out of it, which is really meh for me. It's sort of like, um... Uh, what's it called? Objective Obsession on... On DVD. Uh, if you're on, if it, that used to be so broken. If you're on comms, you could always see where the killer was, basically. And let your team know where they were. If you're, uh, if you're on comms. Well, at least I, I, like, this spawn on this map, I always know where there's an unlock tool straight away. I'm guessing they don't really, like, have RNG for the unlock tools. They just kind of spawn in the same spot all the time. I don't know how, how I feel about that being sort of, like, linear. I want to get this tool, but, uh... Someone... Causing a bit of chaos. She's making so much noise, man. Hey, what's up, Ronan? She's sprinting through shit right next to me. Right, let me, uh... Oh, I've got to start this again. Save, man. Sonny, you don't have any friends. You think you do, but you don't. Maybe Sonny's like one of them unlikable characters like on uh, on Dark Picture games. <laughs> a lot of RNG, there's a mix-up of them, but not super random. Alright, we got the... We got a Shank Shank, and we got a Screwdriver. Personally, I, you know what? I think the Screwdriver would uh, be a bit more powerful than a Bone Shard. Oh shit, you didn't see me right? Oh, he fucking did. He did. Run, 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 run. Get in there. See you, Bubba. Let me cut this down real quick. Here he comes. He's not gonna see me, right? <laughs> Sneaky as fuck. You need to up your gamma settings, bro. down please <laughs> the natural camouflage <laughs> he's like a p3 claudette on dvd Hear something? I don't know what. I don't know what I heard. I'm getting up these stairs though. The boys, we out. Oh, there's something there. I don't know what it is. Oh, hello, Mr. Hitchhiker. How you doing? Bro, this guy is so quiet. He's like a fucking snake as well, like. You just get through here. Ooh. 
Yes, I punched his ass. What is the point in that? Oh shit, there's another guy. I'm gonna die. Can we talk about this? <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Why have I got two of them on me? Seems rather unfair. No! <laughs> I was meant to go through and close it on the other side, man. Someone escaped? What? Oh, I'm not surprised they escaped when I got two of them on my ass. Fucking chasing me down. That was a good jump scare from Kook. <laughs> I'm dead, man. I was doing well until I had fucking two of them on me. I don't I don't need to see Bubba dancing. I mean these guys escaped, but still had I got some decent points. Now Sunny will die first like every horror movie ever is there <laughs> is there, well, I did. I think I would yeah. They all they all fucking They all escaped. Three out, not bad. Fucking two of them chasing me, man. And I had Bubba on me down in the basement, too. That I had to get away from. So I, I don't know where the rest of them them guys got out. But it seemed like the, all the all the killers were, like, on the side... Like, my side of the fucking map. Hey, we're playing as Connie. Nice. Get a test out another survivor. Yeah, I was thinking that maybe they will make the toolboxes a bit more RNG because, like I said, I've, I've spawned in in that um, in that basement like three times and found that same same screwdriver or lockpick. I carried all the pressure that time. Yeah, sadly, I was probably playing the wrong character for that. I suppose that could be a good strat though. Like, if you went in as Leland or someone who can sort of like. Take a bit of aggro while the rest sort of escape. I think this is better than DBD. It's it's a lot more interesting having different methods to escape. Um, I think the chases are a bit more intense as well, rather than it just being like, "Hey, look, let's drop a pallet and teabag the killer and run off," a type of thing. Whereas it this one, you can kind of use the map to your advantage a bit better, with like hiding and stuff. Connie's the Meg Thomas of TCM. <laughs> How does it feel compared to Evil Dead? <clears throat> it's a totally different paced game. I know, I mean, I feel like the games are a bit short. Uh, maybe it's a bit too short in some aspects. Um, anyway, I'd, I'd say roughly about 10 minutes a game on this, on average. So I had a shiv there, but I wasn't sure, like, do you have to sneak up behind a family member to use it? Or can you use it at any time? Because obviously I had one when I grappled the hitchhiker there, but I just sort of, like, punched him in the face. I thought, oh, I was, like, was that, do you think I'd be able to punch him in the face and then shiv him? But I, I really wasn't sure. Mark the Pulverizer, TTV. You don't think it's better than DVD? What, gameplay-wise, Demartus? Search continues in Muerto County for a missing University of Texas student. The Sheriff's Department says Maria Flores, a native...
native of Uvalde was last seen near the town of Newton. Yeah, I've dropped down the well a couple of times. Like to reset. Well, Meg. Oh, wait, Connie. <laughs> oh, yeah, her noise levels is completely different. Like, compared to the rest of them. She's a sneaky survivor. Everyone's gonna be me and Connie, right? So, can you only have, like, one of each survivor as well? Like, you can't have, like, multiple Connies, I'm assuming. All these chicks look like they have OnlyFans accounts. <laughs> hey, Mo, how you doing? Just one of each. Okay. I was gonna say, like, all, all Leland's are all Connie. Imagine all Leland's just knocking the family members over. It'd be fucking hilarious. So, do you need a tool for her to still lockpick things? Or can she do it, like, instantly? Right, how much faster she can gather stuff, man. Oh, shit. You know what would be handy if you did, weren't on comms though would be people like uh sort of having a ability like bond. That's like being able to sort of see where your teammates are a little bit. Yeah, so you need an unlock tool for her. Um I think there was uh on there. Bob is around here somewhere. I can hear him. Cut this down. Be stealthy. That's how you win games, right? I play it all up until stealth to the point where I can just still not escape. Yeah, there is perks and the progression and stuff, so I, I mean, once the game comes out and they have all that, I can kind of see it, seeing it being like quite a fun grind, you know? Cook heard me. Oh dear. I need to find a... You find a toolbox, man. I can't find one anywhere. Oh. Just levitating on things. Um, is this where we were before? No. I mean, you know, if this game's gonna have stuff where, you know, you can... Grind for cosmetics as well, like, and level up your characters would be pretty good. I found some health, but still can't find a unlock tool. Yeah, I mean, this game's coming to Game Pass day one, so I don't even have to buy it since I've got Game Pass already. What's that? It is a bone shard, which we don't need, but... So if someone does your noise as a waiting grandpa, does that mean we've probably opened up the uh, the basement door, right? Oh yeah, look, they know. Like this door is highlighted. Oh yeah, so someone's opened up the door there. I'm gonna try and sneak out. Why oh, they have aggro? 
Nope. Nope. See you, chump. Uh, I can't drop down there. Oh, shit. <laughs> if I could drop down. Bubba's back in front of me as well. Let me just run this way. Just keep running. I don't know. I don't know about this map. I like the other map design a bit better. Shit. Shit. I just ride him into that guy. <laughs> and l luckily, the cook's pretty slow. <clears throat> just crawl into here. Just juke that man. Okay, we chilling. Uh, I'm I'm pretty good at stealth. It's just like yeah, you know, if he finally opened up the door, and then it's the fucking it is another killer you've got to run away from. You're like oh shit. They're trying to sniff me out, guys. I love how immersed you are. You keep running the outskirts of the basement. I ain't gonna run in the middle because I know that's where fucking Bubble likes to be. Go to the girl. Oh, well. I guess she's the one healed. Got some heals? Oh shit. <laughs> We're kind of both a bit trapped in here. I keep trying to heal this person, but they keep moving away. <laughs> Isn't the tech test over? Um, they extended it for one more day. So there's infinite... Yeah, I mean, you say about infinite loops, but you've got... Yeah, there's like three killers in the game. Every man for himself. I mean, me and this guy is literally trapped in this room at the moment. One of us is going to have to bust out. That guy's dead. That means I can get out. <laughs> The sacrificial lamb. Yeah, I haven't found an unlock tool anywhere in the basement. I mean, only opened up that, that one door, right? Acceptable loss. <laughs> Yeah, so th this this is the door that's been opened, right? Although I think they've, I think they've. I oh know this is a different one. Why is lot? Hey, there we go. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna swap it for that. Or not, because there's a fucking killer on me. Sick man. Can hit Tiger. What are you doing down here, bro? You're not supposed to be down here. Alex, man. Yeah, I dislike how long it took me to find an unlock tool on this map. Fucking run. No way, I was gonna say. Close encounter one. Hope that actually did something to that man. Let me just get up here real quick. Close this door. It's gonna be someone at the top of these stairs waiting for me. Run! Oh no. 
Fucking chicken. Oh, what's up, bro? How you doing? We got out! We actually got out. People DCing. Who disconnect? Two, two survivor disconnects on this. Shit. My bad. Did it actually prompt up that grandpa was uh, about to reveal us? I'm shitting in the tall grass. Yo, what's up, Nate? You're a DVD man, you'll like this game. For me, this game was meh. I was hoping for more, I give them. Given this, they stuck to the movies. I like. I mean, I used to play a lot of DVD, so. Mr. Hitchhiker. It's right there. Oh, and people get executed and leave it says they DC'd. Oh, okay. I've only one person died. <clears throat> this guy is patrolling the perimeter right now. I wonder if Sunny's still over here. We might, we might get out with this one, chat. I can just lockpick one of the uh, exit gates, right? Up here. I don't know whereabouts it is, though. Yeah, we, I think we need to get out the front yard. Like, over there. I mean, that's the one you can... I mean, that's the one you can lockpick, isn't it? The point is to feel hopeless. It makes it more rewarding when you do escape, I guess. You need a valve or a fuse in order to deactivate the gen battery. Oh, really? Uh, the gen will be in the front yard, though, won't it? It won't be in the side garden where we're at now. What's this? Oh, this guy's opened it up. Shit. It's grandpa. Bloody grandpa. <clears throat> and that guy's running for it. Shit. I found the generator. I can hear it. I don't think they know I'm here, though. So I just need to kick this gen, right? Run for it? Shut the door. I just need to destroy this, right? Oh my god, it's taking so long. Come on! I can kick it! I thought he could just run down the road. Yeah, 
Yeah, I thought I could just run down here. Oh, so the ground's not electrified, right? So I can just get out. Run! Yes! We did it! See you, chumps. We out. We did it! We did it, chat! We got an escape! <laughs> I'm so proud. <laughs> <laughs> Just jump over that shit. <laughs> Just grow some wings. Oh, look, look at them. These, these guys got carried. Hopeless, they were. Alright, let's, uh, let's try the family out. I'll play whoever. I'll do terrible. But, uh, we'll, we'll see. Yeah, it's up. It's up to the hitchhiker to, um, to turn that generator on. I know that. I'm playing the hitchhiker, so um, is that on both? I mean, I'm on this map in anyway, but is that on both maps? Like the generator? I need to make sure I find it though. Oh, talking? I'm anti-social, did you not know that? <laughs> like the game. It it's weird, okay. It it's It's not something I was extremely hyped for. I was like, oh, it's just gonna sort of be like another DVD hide and seek game. It's it is a bit different. Um Whether I think it's something that would replace me playing Evil Dead, that's totally another... It's just a totally different paced game, you know? It, this would be something where you can just kind of chill, I suppose. Although it is quite anxiety-inducing. It's, it's, it's sort of a bit more relaxing to play than something like Evil Dead. Like, this game is like more entertaining to watch. It is, a, it is really entertaining to watch. I was watching Slash and Cast stream it over the weekend quite a lot. So that's kind of why I know, like, in some places where to go and stuff. Yeah, I mean, there's no there's no reason why I can't play both. Like, if one day I want to hop on and kill deadites, one day I just want to, you know, play as a killer on here or, or whatever. Definitely. I mean, it all depends, you know, what progression system we're going to be getting, you know, updated DLC and, you know, how frequent that's going to happen for the game. <clears throat> I'd probably still get it if it was if it was on Game Pass. I'd probably still get it if it was if it was on Game Pass. Yeah. Um. So is this this guy's base movement speed? Okay. I've got traps as well, so I need to put some traps down. Let's start the generator though. You walk and like and you cheat yourself. Wait, how the fuck do I do this? Oh, it's like a skill. All right. Okay. So I've got to hit it every time it hits the. I pressed it. I know. I'll, I'll get it. I will. I will get that. But yeah, I'm. I'm assuming you just keep pressing it in the in the white marker. What a trap! Oh yeah, that's a good point. I was gonna put it in front of the door, but I put it in front of the generator. Hit the noises, awakening grandpa. Uh, try and put it in a spot that's kind of... I gotta hold it down. I put it down here. Sneaky trap. Why that man running like that? <laughs> it's been having too much fun. I heard someone. I don't want to unlock it. Put a trap down on the door as well. 
Oh, so you can sprint? I think it's A on this. I, I'm, I'm using controller, so... I don't know what sprint is on controller. Obviously, right triggers that. RB is to set down a trap. Be a crouch. Oh, LB. Oh, okay, so it's like DBD buttons. Fair enough. Fair enough. I'm just going to patrol out here. I feel like there's, that should be the hitchhiker's job to always like patrol around these things. I can hear someone moaning. The hell? Someone's like proper screaming. Oh, he's getting executed, that's why. And these guys are doing a good job. Like I'm doing nothing really. Make sure the car battery's on. Someone getting rimmed in the basement. Are you heading out, Glory? I'll see you, man. I'll try it. I'll have some fun. What, uh, what car battery? Victim gameplay is more exciting. Yeah, it's like that in every... You know what it is? Everyone goes like, Oh, well, this guy's a survivor being on... Uh, on stream or whatever. Oh, this up here? Oh. Oh, down here. Okay. I'll have a look. Um. Yeah, this guy's like, ah, oh, yeah. The people be like, yeah, this guy's a survivor main on this. That's why he plays the game so much or whatever. It's like, it's just a joy playing survivor mode. It's got nothing to do with uh, if I get easy wins or not. You know what I mean? And uh, this game comes out August 18th. I believe. Um, so is it this battery here? No, oh, that's a fucking barrel. It's a barrel, Chris. A barrel. There's a valve there. Oh, collect. Collect blood. Got some blood collected. I know. I need to go give blood to grandpa. Someone said I should check something over here though. Bro, I could have swore I fucking heard someone there. This fence is green. Chicken chickens. It's the car straight ahead. <clears throat> this car is everywhere. Oh, this one? I got it. I got it. You watching the X Men movies? A lot a lot of them are good, yes. Anyone in here? No, just checking. Just checking. Feel confident in gun support in this game for a while and like Saber. I think any anyone anyone could support a game better than Saber could. What's this guy's ability when you press up on the D pad? Oh, is that to see where my uh, my teammates are? Grandpa is hungry again. This generator still going? Yeah. And the frames when I come out here is pretty awful.
Oh. <laughs> I, thought, I thought I was a fucking survivor. <laughs> oh, there they are. She went back in downstairs. Where's there? Where's Grandpa? At? So I can give him the blood. And give him the blood. There you are. Have some blood, Grandpa. Gross. <laughs> but he's gonna get more blood. Oh, he found him. Where'd she go? He stole the kill. <laughs> hey, we did it. <laughs> the plan, the family's a bit weird. I know Saber's taking over the remake for uh, Knights Old Republic, aren't they? Uh, very, very mixed on that one. Yeah, I, I didn't do very well. I mean, I, I feel like I did my job to the point where even if they made it outside, they wouldn't have got anywhere. Almost. I don't think I did terrible. I was just... Yeah, I was doing my part for the team. I had high hopes for that game. I know. It's a real shame. I mean, it's because whoever was developing it was sort of like... Uh, being shitty about it. They're not, they're not making a Star Wars game from scratch, so As Aspire Games, who's actually under Saber, were making... I think we're making the remake for Knights of the Republic on PS5. But apparently whoever was in charge, like, saw some gameplay of it or something and was not impressed by it at all. Like, they weren't impressed with how development was going, so they got it taken off them, and, like, people got fired and stuff, and then it all got kind of moved around. So I think that's why Saber sort of took over it. I hope they... <laughs> just don't, don't add any DLC from Texas Chainsaw 2013 in this game. Well, I'll be fine with that. that. That movie was awful. I, you know what it is though, Demarcus. I'm like, yeah, I don't. I want it. I really want to get it because Knights of the Republic's like probably my all-time favorite game, almost. And I'm just like, uh, if if Saber is the ones actually making it, should I care that much? Should I just enjoy the game? I never watched the most recent TCM. I watched uh, whatever one plays Sweet Home Alabama at the start. I watched that one back in the day. There we go, I got it. Generator turned on. Let's trap the gen as well. So I can't really hide a trap with this generator though, unfortunately. Quiet as love it. Oh yeah, he can like break loops, can't he? Why is this guy coming out the front checking that I've done? I've done stuff, man. Don't worry. I sort of know what I'm doing. I'm a noob, but... I'm doing hitchhiker things. Oh, you can collect multiple blood samples. That's good. 
can collect a maximum of 90, I'm guessing. A trap down here. It was a good kind of bad movie though. That is the one where like his cousin gets the uh... Like in inherits the house or something but Bubba's like living in the basement. It is that one isn't it? And then Bubba like, like... I don't know there's people trying to get in the house and then Bubba like ends up killing them. So he like becomes the good guy. Yeah, this guy's got like a little switchblade. I I'm intrigued to see what the cosmetics are going to be like for this game though. I really need to learn the maps on this because they can be quite confusing. I think playing, playing the family will definitely learn the map a lot easier than playing victim though. Because you can kind of see which way to go. Once you get out of the basement and stuff. You open this door. You lock that shit, man. <laughs> that fall. Oh, Grandpa's out here. Oh, okay. I never knew where Grandpa was on this, uh... <clears throat> on this map, so at least I know now. He's getting a nice suntan. His voice reminds me of someone. I don't know who it is. So I'm Matthew McConaughey. Trap that crawl space. Is it like a... Is it quite a... I'll, I'll do it on the grass side. Well, I'm assuming it's quite a... Uh, oh, I don't have any more actually. I'll, I'll trap the door there. It'd be enough. So is there any other things I should do here? Oh, someone escaped? What the fuck? Damn, they're all escaping. I don't know where the hell they are. <clears throat> oh, there you go. Four victims escaped. I have no idea what happened. <laughs> I've, I've never played. I've never seen that map on the family side before, so I have absolutely no clue. I haven't got a clue where to even set up anything. At least on the other map, I kind of know what to do with Hitchhiker. Can I play as Leatherface? I mean, it's a total hot potluck if I play as Leatherface or not. I'm playing Cook this game. Let him cook. What we're doing is Ballard. I know, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I know, there is some weird cutscenes in this game where I'm just like, yeah, we could probably do without that. Especially the one with Grandpa. He's cooking with his, uh, his broomstick. Nah, I probably don't be playing Evil Dead today. I'm not sure why the hitchhiker runs like he's got shit in his pants. To be honest, the hitchhiker in, the, in his picture there looks like Adam Driver. Looks like Kylo Ren. Hey, Burkarama, how you doing? I mean, you have roll queue. You just don't, you know, don't have the option to kind of pick your, your killer or survivor at the moment. You feel weird playing Evil Dead now? Why? It's fake, it's at the end of the end of the road.
Will I do build videos on this game? Potentially, yeah. If I put enough time into it. I played Evil Dead in a hot minute. That double XP didn't mean anything to me. I mean, the double XP thing was a good step forward in the right direction for the game. It's just... I don't know, man. I think the game really needs something like a battle pass to sort of redeem some player base at this point. But I know a lot, a lot of battle passes these days are also seen in a negative light. I, I don't know. It always seems to be a good way to keep people playing a game. Like me, right? I don't know. I <laughs> didn't know me play Fortnite or anything, but I just started playing it because there was actually stuff to play for in the game as well. Jesus is a deadite slayer, Demarcus. <laughs> yeah, t tomorrow at 8 a.m. is uh, the last day. Of, um, well, that that's when the double XP gets turned off on that game. I think probably it's about a few weeks after this technical test ends, they'll put the pre-order stuff out. I think they will be... I can see them doing a beta on consoles as well, which I think will do really well for this game. And you'll have a, a, a bigger sort of player base. Like, they'll probably, they might do a pre-order where you, know, you get the Dulux edition or whatever, you get like early access to the game or like an early access beta. We have a kung fu priest who kicks ass for the lord. <laughs> Battle passes themselves aren't necessarily bad. It's the fact they often suck or are way overpriced to not be guaranteed to get all the rewards. It depends what game it is. You know, some battle passes, which I think is a really... I mean, Dead by Daylight kind of did it right with them, where you earn your... So you buy the battle pass, just say, for £10. But you earn enough currency back from that battle pass to then buy the next battle pass or you can decide to put that on another cosmetic which i think works a bit better that way is a battle pass because you kind of get your money back sort of if that makes sense so you can just keep unlocking all the other battle passes added to the game double lock doors yeah i, I haven't seen much uh cook gameplay Uh, they extended the test for one more day. Apparently. I was going to stream Evil Dead today, but someone told me they extended the test. I mean, it was glory, so I was like, oh, well, I'll do that. Wait, why, why am I just spawned in a room? Like, oh, I can add a padlock to that door. Is that worth? Worth adding a padlock to this door? I have absolutely no idea. Uh, th there's definitely going to be a lot of stuff to learn. This game. Okay, so if I do that, I can like listen for the survivors. Oh, you, you've got to cancel that. Okay, it's toggle. I was holding it down. I was like, why is he still doing it? Does this game have a prestige system? It's too early to tell for that sort of thing, I think. Is there another door in here? Why do I feel like I'm just like sort of trapped upstairs? Oh, okay, so that's a basement. Oh, okay, so that's a basement. No, no. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Okay. Wait, isn't this door normally shut? Dresser. There. 
<laughs> Feel free to backseat as much as you want, guys. I won't get mad, I promise. I just, I, I really, really don't know um, my way around these things or this game, the map or anything yet, <laughs> or how to play certain characters. I'm just like, yeah. I'm going, I'm going with the floor right now. I think I'll switch this stream. Not full time. Definitely not full time. Oh man, I just locked this fucking door. Hey, buddy. Right, bro. It's gonna be much more for the worse than the others find here. I promise you that. I'm fixing a plan here. Oh, no. sure, sure. I got him. Bro, there's no way you fucking shut that. Oh. Hey, what up, bro? I got a good hit on it. I got two good hits on this guy. I'm countering his loops. Somebody went upstairs. Yeah, I'm trying to detect them in the house and stuff. Someone definitely come up here. They must have gone outside somewhere. Yeah. I knew there's someone up here. Get out. Get it, get it, get it. Yes, Bubba. <laughs> And like that, th people seem to like DC as soon as they die. We got one of them. I had a padlock to that one as well. You know that dude shit himself. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, I'm not I'm not hearing anyone. Fresh as it gets. Drink up now. More blood for your grandpa. Play with this Connie before. Very stupid person. She dead on the floor now. Victim detection active. This guy's gotta still be down in the basement or something, right? Mm, Bubba's out here. Cook with his broomstick. I 
I'm trying out killer, yeah. It's a bit weird, to be honest. I'm trying my best to like not suck for the team. Yeah, Bubba running into the sunset. Yeah, what's up, Connor? Why I that? I locked the back fence. Well, the one over here. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, you've got way better like objectives and stuff on this game than it's like than you got on DVD. Always. They've run in animation, I know. Uh, this fence here. I had a padlock to this one. Might be a good one. We'll get some more blood for grandpa. The, you know what's funny though, Shady? How DVD runs on the same engine as this and Evil Dead and looks like absolute garbage. It's like the, one of the worst looking Unreal Engine games I've ever seen. Oh, you, pad you can padlock the fences with the red light? I thought you couldn't because of them being, like, electrified. I got loads of blood for Grandpa. I, I got it on Saturday, but I've had such a busy weekend where I just haven't had time to play it. Shit, someone got out. Someone's by Grandpa. Oh shit, there's someone here as well. Hey. Run. Bro, my frames out here are crazy. Hey, you know what? I'm gonna lock that now. <laughs> I got you locked in. What are you gonna do about it, eh? Oh, she ran into Bubba. <laughs> Had her locked in, though. DVG's a PG-13 game. It definitely feels like it's like made for kids. At this point. Do I have my I've got my mic turned off. I don't have theirs turned off. So I could... I, like, if people talk, I can hear them. I hope they killed that person that was running out here before, right? I don't see anyone moving out here, so I'm assuming they did. Are you passing tests? Well done, man. I wasn't sure if it was today or um, like Wednesday or something, but I'm glad you, glad you passed finally, dude. Grandpa is not hungry. I got loads of- Oh, I seen someone at the front. I seen them. Yeah, Bubba's going after them. That's it. Good, don't it? Yeah, day 135. Yeah, like I, wasn't, I wasn't sure if you had it today or Wednesday, but I Glad you finally passed, lad. Should have passed the last one. I think the last one was just a, like I would have fucking appealed that shit. That sound sounds like a load of bull. This guy is just fucking running around. <laughs> Look at the dead body on the floor. <laughs> just turned into fucking Play-Doh.
guy's in the basement somewhere, right? Oh, there they are. Hey, I found ya! Found you, bitch. She's gone. She's down here, though. she is. Ah, oh, come on, man. Check out a hit there. <laughs> Straight into Bubba. Oh, come on, Bubba. Bubba being stealthy keeps turning his chainsaw off. Did he get her? Oh, I think he hit her. Oh man, I keep running into that thing and I can get through it. Super annoying. <laughs> yeah, he is like an assassin. He just keeps popping up when I'm chasing someone. He's doing a good job of that though, to be fair. Where'd she go? <laughs> Alright, that's how his ability works. Bro, that's pretty OP though. If you like lock onto that. There she is. I'm gonna open that shit. That's alright, Sam. Something different, like I said, it's a different change of pace of game. How the hell do I get out of here? Run round. I knew I should have padlocked that fence earlier. This one. I was gonna padlock it. She's over here, man. It's no problem when you don't have a uh, lever face out here. You won't fucking. He hasn't like broke things, so I can just run straight through. Oh, caught in the trap. Caught in a trap. Yes, I get to execute someone. Let's go. <laughs> Knock some sense in yeah. The hunt is over. Only one person got out. It's only for you though. Oh, okay. I think I did pretty decent there as him. I think I did terrible. That's like the first, obviously, first time I ever played him. I wonder how I'd do as Bubba. I don't think I'd do very well as Bubba. I feel like I'd be more a better as a support killer. I'm tagging people with Cook telling you exactly what location they're standing. Yeah. I see what you mean there. Yeah, so if people disconnect, it doesn't show like who killed them. So people are definitely DCing as they're dying, I think. I, th I think I'm doing okay. I thought I'd be playing a lot worse than what I am. So I'm doing better than before.
than I, well, what I'd expect. Hey, we gotta have a go as Bubba now. I'm gonna do terrible. So what should I focus on on Bubba? Like, obviously, track trying to track them down in the basement a bit. As Fiber says, it's fine to DC and you still get XP. Oh, okay. Like, if, if you DC after you, like, die. Do they have the license for the first movie on this? That could be a good thing, though. You don't want, like, loads of licenses thrown in a game, otherwise you end up in an Evil Dead scenario. Trying to add new content. Keep his chainsaw on. Don't keep his chainsaw on. We're an insidi insidious. No reason to stay. You can't be revived or brought back. Oh, okay. I don't know. I, I mean, I like watching how the games play out. All TCM movies is one IP holder. I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> It'd be cool though. I mean, if they're dedicated to updating the game, then... You know, maybe he's seeing some stuff they can come up with that would suit around the first movie as well. Late 70s era, era could be really good for this game. Chainsaw overheats if you rev it, and there might be a little speed boost when you rev it. So I've, I've never. That's why I'd like to have like a playable tutorial for each character, almost, so I can like at least test things out. I mean, obviously, it's a technical test; it's not going to be in there, but at full release, I think that's something they probably should do for new players, because it is quite a big learning curve. This game, like, to understand what all these icons are and stuff. So is 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 Sissy a uh, original killer? Pressure the doors so you can buy your teammates time to set up. Okay. That makes sense. So Bob is like the basement killer. Ironic. Um Cook's like the house type of killer, and then Hitchhiker's the perimeter killer. But add another name. I'm honestly I'm not too familiar with this IP that much. I've I've only watched like two Texas Chainsaw movies. This game's probably going to be around for like five to six months before it drops off, since they can't really do much with it. <laughs> That's like the worrying thing, I suppose. I I seen the barriers, yeah. I, I was a bit annoyed because when I was getting that last survivor, he didn't break the barrier at the back. And I had to run all the way around. Ed? Not another Ed. Ed Getley, Bubba Face. Leatherface, Bubba Face. <laughs> I haven't seen the Netflix one. I mean, I seen the 2003 remake or something. The 2013 movie, Texas Chainsaw 3D, whatever the fuck it was. That was awful. Yeah, it's around for a good time, not a long time. Quite possibly though. It it depends how committed Gun are to keeping the game fresh. Like, are they gonna be if they're gonna be putting live service content in this game? I can see it being around for a few years easily. It's just that you know that they have to kind of they have to kind of elevate the gameplay as well with their updates and like doing events and stuff, you know.
And destroy doors and crawl spaces. Okay. That's good. And this man's got some bass to his footsteps. Rev my chainsaw. Someone here. Someone here. I got a hit. How did I break this? There we go. I gotta hold it down. I, everything I keep like this, the stuff that I think the way you just press toggle and it'll work, and the stuff where you've gotta hold it down for it'll work. Where this guy go? Oh, <laughs> so you can like hit through that. You can't destroy the them spaces though. Why does it tell me to press LT? What was this person doing? <laughs> They're dead. <laughs> AFK? Oh. Oh yeah, that's- I think that's where Leland was once when he was AFK. Hey, I gotta kill this bubba! Yeah, so with that, you can like chainsaw through those gaps, but you can't do anything else. If someone's upstairs. I think I did well pressuring the doors because I have absolutely no idea where the doors are. I think I ran past a couple of them and that's it. Oh yeah, so you can destroy that door as well. See, that one hasn't been opened. I don't know where the other doors are. I just feel like there's a lot of like, um, <laughs> of these spots. To the point where the killers can't actually fucking move around the map. can be quite annoying, like, to get around the map. Like, it's just, there's so many, like, crawl spaces like those. I'm just gonna unlock this and open it up. Because I feel like they're upstairs. Yeah, I noticed the heart just, like, kind of gives out. Where's Leatherface Rage Mode? Right? Someone in the basement, I think. I think, was that someone on the other side of this door? Oh no, it was, it was, it was Cook. <laughs> I was, uh... Oh, oh, pressed the wrong button. Oh, there's a survivor here. I think they're still in the basement though, somewhere. And I'm trying to get a grandpa, and it's like a fucking... Oh, he's up top this time. Why is he up top? He was on the floor last time. 
Yeah. So you gotta go all the way around. Fuck's sake, man. I literally just lock these up. It's Bubba. I don't think you need to go upstairs. Right? And so I gotta go down and around up here. To give him the blood. Jesus Christ, man. Uh, it, it, it is like literally a maze. Gonna give Grandpa some pats on the head. Yeah, this is a different map. There's two maps in the technical test at the moment. I, is it me? I was like, Bubba's chainsaw look really tiny. Uh, they don't have the valve, I don't think. Oh, they don't have a valve at least. Let me see if there's any like things I can break out here that might help us. Someone escaped? Shit. But they at? Oh man. I definitely let the team down here, because <clears throat> I did not find anyone. Apart from the AFK guy. I think I hit one person that was running from me, but that was it. Oh, this this definitely helps. I totally forgot this even existed. Oh, they're all the way over there. Grandpa getting a nice suntan. The cook did nothing to feed Grandpa. I fed Grandpa with my kill. Bill is on cooldown. Oh shit. Where's the hitchhiker? Oh, that was the hitchhiker over there, and that, that's the cook over here. Seen a lot of newbie procedures today. I suppose that's because of the double XP in it. <laughs> yes, we are hunting down the final victim. I have no idea where they are. Oh, it's this dude. Fucking hell, man. Hey, Thomas, how you doing, man? A uh, gas tank's there. They're both feeding Grandpa up there. Comms are so damn important in this game with no mics going going on family will lose 80% of the games. You think? I don't know. I, I feel like if people like sort of stuck to what they were designed to do, it wouldn't necessarily be a, a terrible thing. Do you mean kill is more chase oriented? Personally, that seems more fun to me. Uh, yeah, I mean, playing killer on this is a bit bizarre. I thought I had some blood. Did I not collect some earlier? 
But it's more, it's more like you uh, have to have a strategy in place, sort of. Like, stick to your strategy, otherwise you can't really do anything. <clears throat> Seven versus three. I don't think the survivors are underpowered in this game. Them to add more. That's where I killed that guy. <laughs> it deletes... Yeah, like, these walls here, there just seems to be... I mean, obviously you've got three killers chasing you. I can kind of see why you need them, but... I'd say they're more needed upstairs than they are in the basement. Because in the basement, you're more likely almost just dealing with Bubba, you know. Oh, so you can escape the basement through this, like if you find a fuse or something. Yeah, so that's an actual... So how do you find the fuse for that? Like, do you have to go up top to get that, though? Like, you can't just do it in the basement. It's in the house. Be an interesting escape, wouldn't it? Rather than escaping out that. I, I mean, I'd love to, like, if the, the technical test wasn't ending today, I'd love to play this, like, off stream and just try and learn almost any, like, almost anything there is to learn about this game. This is a game you'd rather watch someone else play, Bob. Oh, without a doubt, man. Like, I can understand that. I totally understand that. Hunt is over. Oh, there you go. Someone found him. So the fuse is upstairs. Well, I killed an AFK guy, so I'm, I'm, I'm allowed to do my little chainsaw dance. <laughs> it's a shame, though. Um, I think we got. Well, we only got two kills that game. That's what I was saying. If they do a test on consoles or they do a beta, I think that might be like a sort of a pre-order bonus, maybe. Hey, Carlos, how you doing? How's the game so far? I haven't been able to sit and watch any of it. Some, sometimes it looks cool and others it doesn't. I know that that's, <laughs> that's the thing. It's kind of been making me a bit skeptical of like watching people play it. And you're just kind of like... <sighs> You always seem to just be questioning, is it actually any good? But, I mean, I'm having fun so far. I think that's always the main thing, isn't it? Like, I'm having fun playing it. Um, Whether or not, I think it's too early to tell, but whether or not you'll keep having fun once you've learned everything on this game on both sides, that's the question. But games like this, when they're in a technical test and, you know, they're in beta, it was like Evil Dead, for example, was like really fucking fun in the beta because there was just so much to learn. And, you know, the, the fun comes with a learning experience as well. But when, once once that's over with and you know the game off the back of your hand, are you, you going to continue having fun with it? That's always going to be other questions, isn't it?
Oh shit, you, you should have seen one of my survivor games earlier. I was fucking running away from all three of them. I nearly got out as well. So, so close. Tell you what, on my skill tree, I would definitely, on, on the family side, I would definitely lower a cooldown if I could on that ability where you can, like, see shit. <laughs> definitely one of the better abilities. Yeah, I was thinking that, like, on the executions and stuff, the goal seems to be, like, really torn down. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I would expect it to be a bit more gory, but I won't really give them bad points for not adding enough gore. This game looks kind of boring, but I haven't played it, so I'm just holding judgment. It, it's it's a mixture right now, I think. Definitely a mixture. Oh yeah, so. I'm gonna add a padlock to this. I really hope this dude outside has started the generators and, and whatnot. Right, I got some blood to give to grandpa. You need some more blood. That's the climb down there. Yeah, I mean, right now I'm just sort of trying to load the maps a bit. Add a padlock to this. Oh. <laughs> I locked them out. <laughs> a bad dude, I didn't know you were out there. Are you gonna come through, dude? Why are you in here so much? This still definitely needs padlocked as well, because it's just a total way for them to run outside easily. The house is dark. I mean, I can up my gamma settings quite a bit. Because I think I, uh... I think I have it on a quite a mid medium setting. I did. There we go. The hell? Run! Run, damn it! Put the cookie down! Now! <clears throat> it's gone back into the well. Uh, I did good there though. I like pressured that guy as soon as he fucking opened that, so. Like I did a decent job with that. What's up, Rack? How you doing, bro? Good, don't you don't like what, Democrus? It's in beta, so there's always room for improvement before it releases in less than three months. I honestly don't think it's terrible. Like, I, it's just, I, I don't think there's much wrong with this game. 
right now. I think you can definitely have quite a few hours of fun playing this game. <clears throat> it's some it's just something different, like it's good that we sort of have a variety of ASIM games to play now, so you know you have DVD if you are into that still, you can play that. They all three of them offer different kinds of gameplay, Evil Dead, this and and DVD. Someone just ran out the fucking window out the front, I think. I just had a hissy fit when he runs out of stamina. <laughs> Go on, hitchhiker. You get that guy. Look at him. Look at him run after him. These people don't loot all the game and not focus on objectives. <laughs> Wish you could play it right now. Don't tell me this dude. Oh, he got him. Oh, wait, the generator's still on. Does this dude just try and run through the <laughs> through the electric? <laughs> what the? Fuck? <laughs> that dude really tried to run through the electric. Yeah, this is the bit right now, Raka. That's still locked. Locked all that up as well. Bub is on the run. <laughs> I keep I keep losing my grandpa's. He's in here, right? Oh, I can't feed him. There's nobody around here. Someone just made a noise over here. Whether it was Bubba or not. Yeah, it probably was. <clears throat> the chat is bugged again. Sounds like a skill issue, Racker. <laughs> it's like a house to a simulator. Uh, they went out of range. Hey, they're out the front somewhere then. Hi, you sneaky fucker. I knew they were around there somewhere. You sneaky little bastard. I know you're in here. So oh my god, man. It's looking into a pit of just pure darkness. Where'd they go? Oh, that 
sponsor and buy you a car. What? <laughs> sponsor you buying a car. We'll get this sorted out, Grandpa. Don't you worry. Have some more blood, Gramps. Oh, I know. <laughs> Right? It's crazy how much they offered me for that. They're in the basement. I hit him on my broomstick. Somebody upstairs as well. I mean, is it the same? Was this the same guy we were chasing? <sighs> Let me unlock this real quick. Now we were chasing Sonny before. I have no idea where he's going. <laughs> he was there watching all their players go to this. Oh, he's down there. You see him now. He was moving when Gram Grandpa detected him. around this way. See if he winds up running into me. Blocking off these crawl spaces. Oh, I need a flashlight. <laughs> Get him! Get him, boys! Did he go through the wall? You see what I mean? That like he goes through one wall section, you've got to run like half a fucking... Marathon to get round to that. The hunt is over. Oh, he just bled out. <laughs> he did. <laughs> this game is frustrating me. I'm not even playing. It's just play, playing the killer can be annoying like that. Like trying to kick, like counter someone, but you go to counter them and you've got to run around like half a fucking half a mile to get there. That's the only problem. I didn't get a kill, but I thought I did decent, like, patrolling the house quite well. Uh, 
Oh, I'm playing Bubba again. I didn't get. I didn't do too well as Bubba last time. But we'll 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 see. At least now I know where I can like view the uh, view the doors downstairs. Put an engine under the car. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> Put an engine from a car under fucking grandpa's wheelchair. <laughs> Around the outskirts, more than the middle to find people. Oh, in the basement. I'll, I'll play the basement as Bubba. Like, I play Survivor then and go around the outskirts. Yeah, I, pl I played quite a bit of Survivor before. I think I had to go as all almost all the Survivors apart from Leland. Oh, Survivors kept DC when I played over the weekend. I got it got kind of annoying, so I would just let the Survivors finish objectives and escape. Put a pipe bomb under Grandpa. <laughs> Most of the stuff to pick up for the survivors around the outskirts. I've noticed um, on this map here, it's pretty easy to find stuff. But on the other map, on Survivor, I thought it was quite difficult to find like uh, the lock picks and stuff. I don't know if they'll add the power to come back as, <laughs> as Sally from 2022 after Survivor dies like Tommy and Friday. Quite possibly. Bring in Sally to hunt down the family. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Gran Grandpa screams and detects the survivors. An intensive massage chair. Can you actually get one of those? I don't think it'd be much of a massage if it was uh, really intensive. I am late. Go back to Evil Dead. Why? <laughs> There'll be still plenty of Evil Dead to play. Oh, this stream is already covered. You should have played it day one instead of a broken Evil Dead with Bull. What? <laughs> oh, with Bill. <laughs> I was I was gonna say I was like what? <laughs> Sally is so shit in the Netflix version. Please no. I've, ne I've never seen the Netflix version because you guys all said it was terrible when it came out, so I just never bothered. Can't wait to unlock more more ties as Bubba though. But that that's the problem, Devon. Like, yeah, you know, Evil Dead is Evil Dead. You love that franchise. You love the game. You just, yeah, it's like a, you're just being sucked into a black hole of misery with that game, unfortunately. Because we just don't, we don't know uh, what the future holds for that game. I did, yeah. Oh god, that was a fucking nightmare yesterday, being up on a roof. Yes, our chat is very sensitive, Nicholas. You'd be wise not to set them off. And me. I'm a very sensitive person. It's a Monday. Everyone's sensitive. Hey, Livingston. <clears throat> it was kind of funny. I'd have to watch it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that, that, that's the thing, Devin. It's, it's got the foundations to be something fucking amazing. They put live service stuff in. It's just not going to happen, though. And to someone who's played the game so much, and a lot of you guys have played the game so much on Evil Dead, you're just going to be... You need to have a purpose to play the game, and we just don't. 
Any chance this game dethrones DVD? Quite possibly. I've already seen quite a lot of content creators and stuff leave DVD. Not necessarily cover this game, but, you know, just having people are finally understanding that game of uh, how much of a shit show it is. Got my chainsaw ready. Like this blood. So I can't I can't see like the escape doors here. Unfortunate. Shit show sure going on for eight years plus. I mean you might start seeing the downfall of it with a lack of license and it's getting the, the thing is though, it's getting a movie, it's getting like a super massive game made around it and stuff. They're having a PvE mode, so who's to say that doesn't really get A lot better. Hey, I bounced him on. Uh, that's. I feel like they're not alone over here. I see them. I see them go through the door. I was just checking to see if. Um, I was just checking to see if there was someone else. down them doors. Oh shit. There's a couple of years over here. I don't know who to fucking go for. The cook should be really, uh, patrolling this a bit, like, over here. Going back down into the well. <laughs> I know. The thing is, Bubba's chainsaw just looks so damn small as well. Game won't respond to your controller. What controller are you using? Yeah, I'm playing on I'm playing on uh, Xbox controller right now. I know um, another streamer that had that problem with the controller though. Bro, I seen someone come in here before. Don't know where they went though. Hmm. Don't know, I got a Scooby Doo. Keep going over there. Yeah, I don't know where this guy went. Someone came into this this fucking house though. I'm guessing he just ran out. 
went somewhere. I was kind of hoping there was a way into the basement in this bit, but I couldn't. I couldn't find it. Little Bubba, little Bubba with his little chainsaw. Yeah, I was expecting the dude to have a bigger chainsaw though. Play the Scooby Doo chase scene music over this. <laughs> Zoinks! I can't use it again. <laughs> she really thinks she's gonna hide that. I can see your ginger head. Are you kidding me? Why can't I trigger that after she just goes through it? She ran back down into the basement. <laughs> what is she doing? What? Oh, she went this way. I got hitchhiker with me now. She going here? She did. <laughs> I found you, bitch. Angry noises. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, I was gonna get the hit that. Nice. Well done, sir. Man, I was chasing that bitch for ages. <laughs> that was funny, finding her in that fucking, uh... That freezer, though. Imagine how popular a Scooby-Doo ASIM game would be. No, you know what they should do though? They should just make a Warner Bros. ASIM game and then you could have like all the Warner Bros. characters in it. Like multiverses but ASIM. Put the cooking down! Now! <clears throat> this person just went into the basement as well, I think. I thought there was a way into the basement in here. I just ran by it. Yeah, it's over here. Grandpa is hungry again. Now, I've got some blood for Grandpa, but... We know this guy's down here somewhere. Get him! Get him! Ah. <laughs> uh. Got him! Yes. 
We're gonna hitchhike what the fuck. <laughs> one person left. Is this the one I was chasing earlier? No, that was no, no, that was Connie. Connie got um Connie got killed though. Went down final victim. And these guys are over here. Grandpa's in danger. Oh. Well, there you go. I'm in danger. Nothing but a flesh wound. <laughs> Gonna destroy these crawl spaces. I tell you one thing though, this game is way more fun than like other ASM games I tried like last year and <clears throat> you know fucking Ghostbusters. Definitely. Did I not hit her there? Are you kidding me? Like what in the actual fuck? Uh, yeah, this this one right here is pretty OP because the only way to kind of counter that one is to like go all the way around. That one is pretty strong. She down there. Oh, someone just hit her though. I think someone got her. Yeah, she dead. Comforted noises. We did it. <clears throat> I I mean, like I said, I, th I think this game's just way more fun than like most other ASM games that come out. Um, that always try and make it, like I said last year, VHS, like those types of games, Ghostbusters, fucking whatever, like, it's definitely way more fun than those games. I think it's on like sort of a more understanding of what a an ASIM game is compared to um, what those games attempted, you know. We'll swap back to the Survivor now, because we play quite a bit of uh, the family. I don't think I did too bad on the killer side. I think it was only really one game where we lost, like, everyone going through the gate at one point. I don't think we did too bad on the on the family side. God rest VHS is so... V you know what it is, though? VHS, I thought, was a fun concept. Like, it was a really good idea, you know, like, crafting weapons and you have to hit the... hit the monster with, like, each sort of weapon like each different type of weapon like you know so you had to hit them four times with the, the the crafted weapons i thought it had a really cool concept it was just very poorly executed unfortunately <clears throat> hey i'm anna again man Bubba isn't really Bubba v isn't camping hooks well someone someone said that they added the ability for him to like hook survivors on this Any game where you can be fully killed as the killer just leads to stress and bullying, so I'm good. Oh, so you mean like games like Evolve and VHS? Yeah, <laughs> Prop Night. I have played Prop Night. I played that with Con. Um, I played Home Sweet Home Survive as well. Like all, all these different games, they just... They feel very rudimentary and then you can tell they're made by like an indie studio. Compared to a game like this, DVD and Evil Dead. I think this DVD and Evil Dead are probably the big boys of like the ASIM. Unfortunately, Evil Dead is just on a downward spiral right now because everything's just so up in the air with that game. Me and Chris, the ASIM duo. Hi. Oh, you know what though, Con? I had fun playing last year with you. I mean, that was that was interesting. I was just laughing my head off, like, <laughs> like <laughs> that one spider guy. 
that was just fucking camping the objective. So it like despawned. And you just come up with the flamethrower and he fucking runs away from you. He absolutely shit. I think you killed him as well with the flamethrower in the end. I hate to say it, chat, and I'm not, uh, you know, not being an Evil Dead simp or anything, but I think Evil Dead, the game, was the perfect ASIM game. That, that, the concept of that and the design of it, yeah, the balancing's not great, but it could have been balanced and made to be almost perfect like the way it's designed and the concept of it is easily i think the most exciting and like play it like good for player retention game out there like for an asm game nightmare on elm street that would be a good one especially like working with the dream world and stuff they could, like a, de a dev studio could have a lot of fun there with an ASIM game. I know. I mean, you can't really say it's a competitor, but when you're looking at all the ASIM games out there, I would literally say those were the top three right now: was DVD, this, and Evil Dead. I don't think anything else comes close to those games. <coughs> Lot, you know, when Evil Dead come out though, I remember a lot of people like putting video clips on YouTube and stuff like, oh look how boring this is, like all, it was like four people all just mashing the same button on, on a fucking Deadite or whatever. It's like, there's a lot more to the game than just that. So I feel like, you know, videos like that kind of put Evil Dead in a, in a bad spotlight as well. But, nah man, it's just, it's so frustration because someone like me who covered the game for such a long time, not seeing it kind of flourish into something it could have been. It's quite disappointing. And of course, everyone here in the chat as well who's played it will understand that. How painful it is because we don't know what's actually going to happen with the game. I think if there was a player kill it in Outlast Trials, I'd compete, but <clears throat> it's only PvE now. Oh uh, yeah, I, that sucks though. Yeah, I think Outlast Trials could compete with it a bit. I played ASIM over than Evil Dead, and I don't particularly want to change that. I'm an Evil Dead simp. <laughs> I am too. But variety doesn't hurt. I'll say that. Covering content, having a variety of, like... You know, if I could, you know, swap between this and Evil Dead every day, I'd, I'd be quite happy with that. And in terms of, like, making videos and stuff, you know, doing build videos for this and build videos for Evil Dead side by side wouldn't be a bad thing. I think... The ultimate, for me, personally. I know it's not really horror much, but the ultimate ASIM game for me would be probably covering something like Stranger Things. A Stranger Things ASIM game that had loads of live service around it. I'd, I'd fucking love that, man. I would go so hard on that. I wish you would swap Evil Dead and the goat, but hey, I know you ain't going back to the goat. <laughs> Can't do it, man. Trust me, Chad. I've I've debated it. I've I've tried. I just I can't do it. That was kind of bad timing for me there, because I was sort of crawling as that shit was going on. So, yeah, that sucked. Bubba's down there. I see you, Bubba. He's just standing there. Oh, he's cutting that up. Is he gonna come down here?
And Bubba's like right on me, I think. I can hear, I can hear him. That was survive, never go to Texas. <laughs> I don't think Evil Dead is the perfect A sim or whatever, but I much prefer different aspects from both. They both just seem like trash to me at this point. I'm more inclined to play Evil Dead if I had to choose though. What, between this and Evil Dead? Oh, yeah, between that and uh, Dead by Daylight. I mean, yes, there is flaws. I'm just, you know, like the concept of Evil Dead, I think, was... Wait, what's that? Was almost perfect, man. Like, I, I think the, the whole Dungeon Master type of... gameplay is way more fun for, like, for both sides. That's why I thought Resident Evil Resistance was so good, too. But I know a lot of people don't like the ASIM games where you can't, like, fight back, I suppose. Yeah. I just think it was very poorly executed. Oh shit. He knows me. He knows where I am? Uh, what the fuck? I didn't make any noise. I think mean, this guy brought him over to me. Shut the door in his face. <laughs> Fucking get out my way, bro. Bubba's on my ass. <laughs> that dude got that dude just got fucking cooked by me. I'm dead man. And Bubba, I'm stream sniping. <laughs> I know. I accidentally ran the killer into him. He's around here still, though. Is he on the other side of that door? Oh, oh, he's there. I see him. They just quietly sneak away. I know, I don't, like, I just, it's bizarre for me. It's quite, it's quite a small chainsaw. Oh, but we're talking about here. Oh, I forgot to activate my ability. To be honest, I didn't think I was uh, going to get hit straight away, but... I forgot to activate my ability so I didn't get hit. Alright. I think we're good for now. Hey, what's up, Sunny? You follow, follow me around like a lost puppy. Don't worry, dude. I know exactly where to go. Hey, look, there's some health for you here. Get the health, bro. I got some. I just picked it up. Okay. Man, I don't. I don't really need it right now. But... All right, so you can crouch through those things without making noise. That's good to know because I didn't know that. I kept cutting them down, thinking I'd make noise if I crouched through them. If the victims can kill, killers get the fright of the footing for every match is just a bully simulator. Oh. This dude's just come out of nowhere too. It depends though. Like in terms of balance and how that works, you know. It really does depend. I don't think Evil Dead was too far away from being balanced until they released that prestige system that just totally fucked it. I thought that guy had the fuse. I wonder where you get the fuse from. Oh, kill him, Ademus. <laughs> Wait, who has an insta-kill mechanic? Bubba? Is that if you like rev his chainsaw up enough? Oh, shit. Oh, he just fucking ran through. Very cool.
What the f- What just happened? Oh shit. Through that. I love how I just ended up with a hitchhiker on my ass. Just go through here. There's gotta be something I can use around here. Oh, Jesus. Well, I don't... <laughs> it kind of hit me last second. Because I didn't even know who it was at first. And I just get fucking stabbed. I'm like, oh, okay. Cool. Ah, uh, Rip Leland. I don't rob it, man. Yeah, I'd say this game is more fun than DVD. It's it feels quite difficult playing Survivor though. But maybe I'm just a fucking noob at this point. Which I I would totally agree with. I would totally agree with that. Fucking chackens. Oh, is it is that someone opening the fucking The exit? Wait, what? I'm so confused what just happened. <clears throat> it looked like that door just opened. I'm so confused. This will be coming to Xbox, but the tech test is on PC only right now. Which is what I'm playing on. Ah, there's the fucking door I was looking for. <clears throat> Game pass, yes. Game past day one. It's too quiet. Something's not right. I think one of them opened up the, the door I went upstairs in. Being a victim in this game is more difficult than DVD. The game is killer side, but it's supposed to be that way in a horror game. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> Shit. Run. <laughs> it's my last. Oh, he put a trap right on the window. I'm gonna die. It's my last hope. Chat. Oh, the generator's not over here. I think, it, I think it's... I think that's still electrified, isn't it? Yeah, it's electrified. Shit. Please tell me there's a well over here. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. It seems I've lost them. Is there not a well over here? <laughs> I had them on my ass. I just had to jump out of the... I tried to jump out of the fucking window, but there was fucking two of them just right on me. Oh, an XP will be saved. Wait, what? Killed by Cook Crystal Lake Council? Oh, Crystal Lake was a Friday the 13th thing. Yeah, you can run towards the road, but you need to turn you need to turn the generator off. Because they're like the ground's electrified.
I'm playing the tech test on my Nokia, so you're obviously lying, sir. Alright, don't get the legal eagles involved. Hey, we're finally playing Leland. I haven't tried this guy yet. But yeah, so far, I've won more games on Killer than I have on the uh, on the Survivor team, on the victims. Oh, Demarcus, did you try uh, Wayfinder? I never tried it. He's a fake Scotty. <laughs> uh, so the so the gen can like spawn. I think there's two spawns. So there's one at the front normally, or it's around the back of the house. I think. We find it was great, even though it started off pretty mid. I I never try. Is the is the uh, the beta still going on for that? Never got around to install it. I tried the 13th IP best. Such bullshit about that lawsuit that killed it. I I honestly I never played. Uh, I I played like two games of Friday the 13th, and it was a. Uh, I remember coming like I remember playing as like Tommy Jarvis, and I was like, "What the fuck is going on?" I shot Jason's mask off and then I died. But yeah, I, I had no idea what was going on in that game. It was, it was just so much shit happening. Oh, it ends today. Oh, okay. I'll probably not get a chance to play it then. Four escape routes on each map. There's going to be three maps on launch. I mean, it's good that we've got different maps because I was kind of worried that we weren't going to get any extra maps. Oh, I never knew that. So you can cut down as many bone chimes as you want. You won't lose, won't lose your uh, bone scrap. <coughs> you can still play Friday the Thirteenth. I think it's just uh, peer to peer. They 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 took down like dedicated servers, but you can still find a game on it. I think. So th this guy is more like uh, the warrior of this game, I suppose, right? Just bashing his way through to victory. What the hell happened? Please lead somewhere good. Just hack games so on Friday the 13th. The game I played had fucking Jason teleporting everywhere. I don't know what the hell was going on. And then this car, like, Jason stood in front of a car and the car started, like, freaking out. It was very concerning. Yeah, last, last game on this, I forgot to use my ability. I need to keep remembering to use my ability. Oh shit, he searches. That's like really loud. <clears throat> this is this is Scotty if you order him from wish.com. Ah uh, bro, don't don't tell me. Don't tell me they're actually done with it. The noise has a woken grandpa. And Bubba was right there, man. What the hell? Oh shit. No. 
How did I end up with Bubba on my ass, man? Oh, I never realized you could also, like, sort of, like, jog on Survivor. <coughs> and then and then there's a sprint as well. I never knew that. Well, good to know. Right, I keep getting so lost in this fucking basement, though. Escape through the slaughterhouse yard. They run like they got a poop. That's why they're holding their stomachs. Shit, dude. Come out of nowhere. This door is not open. Fuck's sake. I feel like I'm getting very unlucky on the survivor side of this game. the fuse the fuse door <clears throat> fucking bubba man he's always on my ass i have the worst look i keep my eyes peeled i hear the door i'm finally out of the fucking basement thank god I won this. Easy. Come on. <clears throat> Run. <clears throat> oh shit. Fucking run. Come on. Yes, yes. No. It's only opened up for a limited time, I'm guessing. Fuck's sake, man. Knocked him on his ass. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. That's locked as well. Hey man, I used to do this. I used to do this every day for a living. You know, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> Why is my guy crouching? I did press the button too. Bro, I just had like L3 killers on me like all fucking game. It's crazy, dude. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? I'm giving them them, them DVD loops. What I'm known best for. Yeah, they left, but like, I'm getting like, yeah, the thing is, I keep getting killed and stuff because it's like, yellow aura comes up and I'm like, oh, look, that door's open, that door's open. And then all of a sudden it's like, well, I can't do anything. And he got down here quick. Game wants to be DVD, so, and you know what's sad? No, I don't, I'm running fast because I had fucking Bubba on me from the start of the game. Like, the sad thing is, 
as for whatever reason I ended up with leather face on me even though I was playing all stealth and then I fucking finally get out the basement and then I had them two clowns fucking chasing me too I mean you can try and queue up see if you can get my game just let me know when you're ready to search lad Eight of your fingers, Jesus. You ready? Okay. Go for it, lad. It's funny. It was funny knocking that guy in his ass. Satisfy that. I, I really need to put more time on the victims, though, because I. Just, when I played it as a family, I felt like it was just so much easier to do, like, to play each role. Victim, it's just, it seems so difficult, man. <coughs> Didn't get in my game, Con. I believe they didn't, um... I had a party system on this. I'm Sonny again every time. <laughs> well, luckily I got Leland so I can try him out again. Preferably when I don't have Leatherface shitting down my throat all game. Yeah, the timer for the- yeah, so it's like they opened up that and I had literally about five seconds to get there. But, like, no, nobody typed in the chat or anything on the game. That's the problem, like... <sighs> For people who aren't on mic, this is going to be very difficult to play. I would say ASM games struggle with that type of thing, where it's, like... There's people who want to be on comms, there's people who don't want to be on comms. Con's going to be Bubba when he finds you. <laughs> Probably would. It'd be a, be a little face camper. Then you fix that stuff because you can get caught instantly just for breathing. No, that, that's the weird thing though, like, it was like Bubba just kind of accidentally found me. Because I was just crouched waiting for him to move by. No, I'm, I could hear people if they were talking though. But they're not. I'm not getting on my mic for this shit. Ah, definitely not, man. I think there should be a, probably a fast, like, communication wheel, like... Hey, I've got the valve or something. You know, for people who aren't... ...ready for that. Hello, Mr. Ready to be on comms. Hey, but I'm a member for three months, I appreciate it. No matter what game you play, we'll be here. Very much appreciated. Get some hype for Bertarama, please. You can only hear them in game chat. You, no, you can hear them in the lobby. I heard a Leatherface talking before. Um, before I streamed. I'm upside down this time. Oh, imagine all the blood just rushing to your head being here. Yeah, like, everything he does is just super fucking loud. I don't know if I like this guy. Even though people are saying he's, like, better. I would, I would definitely- I think Connie was probably the better one. I think I escaped with Connie as well, right? <clears throat> Somebody awoke in Grandpa already. Uh, I found an exit door. I just need to try and find a tool. 
Yeah, like listening to where the family is. There's a big health there. Def definitely would prefer having that. I just need to find a tool. We can get out of this shit. <clears throat> oh, this guy's already out. He's already opened it. Sonny, over here. Stay quiet. And this guy is just making so much noise. Fuck you, Bubba. What a play. <laughs> I don't think that would actually work, but I'm proud of it. Uh, fucking Grandpa, you had to be right here, didn't you, bro? <clears throat> yeah, th this is the only guy that can, like, stun Bubba. So I just wanted to test that out. But hey, it worked. What a strat that was, though. He shut the door while he was opening it. I knocked him on his ass and it just ran through. <laughs> Got two health bottles. There's a big one as well. I'm gonna grab it. Okay. Bitch shut the door on you. I know. <laughs> She's gonna let, she knew I was there too. She's gonna let me through. So you see that ha that that door is like glowing yellow. Imagine having an ability cooldown on this guy. That'd be good. <clears throat> Alright. So. I mean, whatever that happens with the aura there. Yeah, that that's that's where the fucking... That's where the, the gas tank is downstairs. So I suppose we can try and get down th again and do it. As fast as possible. Oh. Need to get this open. Well, that one's locked. Ah, oh, Bubba's right there. Shit. Don't come over here, bro. Oh, he's fucking coming over here. Fuck it, what is she doing? A crazy bitch. She's just run into me, man. They're like blocking me off. Sandbag my ass. <clears throat> oh, she's dead. Well, I kind of blame her for that because I don't know what the fuck she was doing. I don't know if there's a way into the basement for this. They could be anywhere. <laughs> Connie's booty got killed. I keep finding shit on her health everywhere, man.
It's actually in here. Oh, it's just like somewhere you can kind of hide. No, you can play as the family as well. I was playing them earlier. I tried them all out. Family's pretty fun to play as. I gotta stay focused. And there's a well. Yes, let's go. Into the well we go. Oh shit. <laughs> Take quite a bit of health damage from dropping dropping about 30 feet. Who would have thought, right? <clears throat> okay, so I think Although I've kind of lost my bearings which direction we dropped in. For the gas tank. Alright, so this is the door we have open. Which is good. Uh, I think the the gas tank was like somewhere in the <laughs> it's a soft 40 foot drop. I think the gas tank was somewhere in the middle last time, wasn't it? When we finally found it. Like TCM so far. Yeah, it's pretty good. I totally suck on the victim side though. The 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 one I think the gas tank was here last time, shit. The one game I suck as survivor on. And play better on the killer side. Victim is really hard to understand. It's it's just all the different methods of escape as well. It's like, what do you really focus on? Do you focus on the gas tank? Do you, I mean, I think the house seemed a bit easier to escape from because you just turn the generator off and then run out. But... Yeah, man. It's just trying to find this fucking gas tank. Yeah, Grandpa is screaming. You gotta stand still, otherwise he can detect you. What do we have here? Driving some lockpicks and escaping max one minute. There, yeah, there's people trying to do that. <clears throat> I think the that's what that's what I'm saying. Like the game's fun because you're still trying to learn it, but you know when people start learning metas and stuff, that's when sometimes games like this can really struggle to flourish. He's like a bat. But yeah, right right now I'm looking for a gas tank down here where I can overpressurize it. But I can't find it right now. And this place is like a fucking maze. I will say though, I've definitely noticed a lot more items this game. Level 5 Grandpa OP. We had a level 5 earlier. Yeah, I feel like I've been in a circle again, so I haven't found this gas tank. I don't think we went this way last time. We'll go this way. I bet this is just like a dead end room. Oh, so you can like crouch faster as well. Okay. 
Oh, is that it in there? I don't think it is. How do you drop it though? Should I just search? Pick up a med. That's probably easier. <laughs> now, after all the health kits I've found, it's trying to find a fucking health kit again, isn't it? There you go. I fucking crouched and he uncrouched, man. Oh yeah, it's right there, look. Now uh, you know what happened there? Is they, they need to remove the automatic crouch as a function because it's super fucking annoying. Crouched by itself, so I uncrouched and then walked into them bone chimes. Family side's all about it's like one does like the perimeter, one covers the house, and one covers sort of like the basement at the start of the game. So there's a bit of a strategy to play in that. There was a ladder right next to it. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> There's a fucking ladder there the whole time. Okay, now I just need to know where I am. Baron wise. Okay, right. I know where to go. Shit. How do I get over there though? I'm gonna have to go around the other way, aren't I? Oh, fuck off, bro. In no way you knew I was there. Fucking okay, run. I'm gonna knock this guy in his ass. Come on, bro. What you got? Get out my way. <laughs> yes, I did it. <laughs> Fucking comical. Just knock his on it knock him on his ass. I'm surprised that went well for me because last time it didn't after I did that uh, pressure valve. Oh no, is Sonny going to make it out? Dude, you need to put some more effort into kicking that gen. Woke up, get, get my key. Finally said that I only have one day to play, play though. I don't know if I'm even yeah, we're going to actually run it. To be honest, I don't think the game takes much running because my PC is not great. Oh, it seems to do pretty well. Dude, you just need to plow through this. Doesn't even matter about making noise at this point. You gots to go, man. He's out. Hey, he did it. I like the lockpicking minigame, yeah. <laughs> fuck was he doing? He was kicking the gen, so it would, um... He was kicking the generator, so it wasn't electrified anymore. But hey, uh, this dude had like 2,475. Fucking hell. Lockpick mechanic can be kind of cheese. I uh, probably is from a Connie player. You want to try and uh, queue up again, Con?
We'll try again, sir. Hey, two escapes on the victims. I got like quite a few kills on the family this stream. Quite proud of that. So let me know when you're ready, dude, and we'll search. <coughs> what? Check Discord. Okay. I'm sorry I hear that, Robert, man, but yeah. Um, the pleasure it'll, it's always been mine, dude, having you around like that. <clears throat> um, I'll, I'll message you later, though. Uh, Icon, let's start. When I played as a family, who are you? I played as all three. Uh, I played two as Hitchhiker, one... No, two as a Kook. And two eyes, Bubba. It's refreshing seeing new stuff. It, it's different. <laughs> it's definitely different. Um, I can have a lot more fun with it. Uh, didn't get. Oh, Con, if you queue again, you might get in because there's a spot on my team. Yeah, what, what I'm kind of looking forward to is potentially new games coming out. Um, who's to say there's not going to be like some more ASM games coming out that aren't TCM or whatever. And it could be a different, different license, which, you know, could be very intriguing. If you have that, this game, and then Evil Dead to swap, swap between as a content career, that's just like so much you can do. On the family side, um, I don't think I did too bad as Leatherface. To be honest, all, all three I thought I did okay with. Uh, Cook is a bit of a funny one. I don't know if I'm that good with him. Or Cook, whatever you guys want to call him. I, I don't know if I'm that good with him. But the other two I didn't think I did too bad with. Went in two different lobbies, sunny both times. <laughs> I, still got, I still got a spot on my team, so... Uh, there shouldn't really be much of a delay with the stream today because I have it on ultra low latency. So it should almost be instant to me like queuing up and stuff. There's an ASM game about aliens that's supposed to come in as well. It, well, uh, fr from the f Aliens franchise or just like a random alien? There's a lot of alien playing Evil Dead for me right now. <laughs> you got insta lobby both times you tried. Well, so far I've escaped as Leland and Connie. It, it's very, it's very difficult to escape though, on this game, very difficult. <laughs> oh yeah, I know you can. Uh, you can put a bone shard into bra into grandpa. Stab his ass. Hitchhiker was honestly scary, nothing like seeing a crouch figure and thinking you had, you had backup, only for it to be slashing your throat. <laughs> that, that happened to me one game. I honestly thought he was a, he was a survivor and he just like swiped at my ass. I was like, oh shit. Random aliens. I think it disables uh, Grandpa for a limited time. What I gathered from it. I know from from watching the game. Like, what do you guys think is more intriguing to watch? Like, family side or the victim side? 
I mean, they both have their like pros and cons to like watching and playing though. Definitely. I mean, I think when you're playing victim, it's like you're playing totally stealth and you're just, like, it's just a fucking maze that you just get lost in. You like watching the family side. I mean, yeah, I mean, that's the good thing about it. Like this game is like, yeah, you know, kind of playing on a team on either side, different types of play styles, but you can still kind of enjoy it. That's why I was like, when this game, they said it was like a team sort of killer of killers. It's actually an ASIM game I might play killer on, where it's not just, you know, you by yourself getting kind of bored. Cause I, I like to play with people, you know, especially like people in, in my stream and stuff like that. Better than DVD, yeah. Reach it, your first 100 subscribers. Yeah, I, I seen on your channel, well done. Congrats. <laughs> I remember reaching my first 100 back in the day. God. Ruling. You know what? It took me. It, it might seem to take me forever, though, getting to 1,000. I think after 1,000, it wasn't so bad trying to grow the channel, but getting to that first 1K was so difficult. He actually shit me, dude. The good thing about Sonny, though, is the Marcus said he's got that, uh, that natural camouflage. <laughs> I keep forgetting that first time that Grandpa can actually detect you, so I start moving around thinking, oh, it's fine. We woke up Jack. Jack's the grandpa. Let me get this bone shard real quick. I say real quick. fucking sprinting around man they always run into me and they end up with a killer on my ass <clears throat> did someone open the door over here or something I'm just going to cut down these as well. I mean, it's a good thing to do. Helps in the chases a bit. Always make it disarmed. Give me the point. Uh, do that. <coughs> Why'd that just go loud all of a sudden? Seems like I could search for quite a long time. Without it going too loud, and then I, every time I search now, it's like jumping straight up. Alright, we got it. <sighs> nice. I have no idea who's chasing me, but I'm getting the fuck out of here. Hey, or being stealthy. <laughs> yeah, that's what I did, Robert. Like, you know, at the start, when I started searching the box, I held it down. 
And then as soon as it went too loud, I just, um... I just started tapping it, and then it just seemed to, like, keep going louder and louder. Uh, I'm not sure if... Yeah, I think Connie can make it so she can pick locks faster um, without making much noise. In fact, I'm growing is just so new and a little stressful too, though, because I have to start putting out better content to grow further. Yeah. I will, I will say this, though. What I learned... We're trying to grow. We're trying to grow my channel was the stick with one game. Hey, Bubba. Should we get the valve? Uh, so this guy, if he presses his ability, I think he can see like the family members and stuff. Like, nearby. So, obviously, Grandpa's up there. So I can see him. He's also got the power of uh, camouflage. <laughs> He's a sneaky boy. Oh, man, I wanted to shank that guy. Shank, shank! That guy totally fucking heard that. <laughs> Dude, he's so creepy. Why is he like eight foot tall up there? Jank, jank. Wow. Oh, the the fucking cook was there as well. Shit. Well, that didn't go well. Oh, what's going on with my camera, bro? Oh, yeah. And I drop on a fucking bubba, of course. <laughs> of course. Get through that. Get through that. Get through that. Where am I gonna go? I don't know where I go. I've been fucking terminated. Oh, there's two of the killers right there. Please go away. How the hell did they escape? And the bid ends the day. This is the last day of it. I need to find some health ASAP. Uh, why is it not healing? What the fuck? Alright, I should have grabbed that valve when I had the chance. <laughs> Let's go up and try and get the valve, I suppose. And I'd like to try a different way of getting out, but the valve seems like the only method I've been able to... Well, that and the... And the, uh... The generator on the other one. I haven't been able to, like, find, like, do the fuse one. Or anything yet. He plays cook the main job is for him to feed grandpa since he collects the most blood. Yeah, that's what I was doing when I was playing as him. Ooh, ooh, we found a fuse. 
Use collected. Okay. So we, we take that downstairs, right? Oh no. There's something over there. Alright. Let's try it. Something different for once. And try and get out the other way. Uh, can I loop round? No. Guess I have to go through this uh, red door. You put ads on your videos. Nice. But you gotta get, you can put, I thought you had to have a thousand sub, it might be different now. You used to have to have a thousand subscribers and four thousand, uh, four thousand hours watch time to get monetized on YouTube. That might be different these days. Especially if you have like YouTube shorts and stuff. It goes quick if you keep tapping it. Yeah, I thought it did. So if you tap it, it might make more noise though. Right, so the fuse was like over that direction. If we can get over there, I think we might be golden, but I don't know. I've never used the fuse before, so we'll see what happens. I get it escape the sunny. Ah, oh, here it is. Oh, so this goes in... Oh, are you fucking kidding me? I've just used that to unlock the door before... Oh, come on, man. I just used that to unlock the door to get over here. <clears throat> I didn't know, know I needed an unlock tool and a fuse. Holy shit, man. I hope... Do you think we'll find an unlock tool up here? I hope we don't have to go back down in the basement for that. Eyes oh, fucking found me. Oh, I didn't realize you. I, I, I'm sure back in the day they got rid of the monetization at a hundred subs because there was just so many people making like um, spam accounts. Ah uh, man, there's no way you know I'm here. I'm not moving or anything. There's no way he knows I'm here. Oh my god. He literally he literally touched me. He literally patted me on the head with his broomstick there. <laughs> Dude, Sonny's OP for this shit. He's so good. Oh, someone was doing the fuse over there. Oh, it was Leland. Run Leland. Run, run, run. Then I can go and do the fuse. My guy, you dare show him where I am? I'm gonna fucking murder you. He's trying to show him where I am. Get away. I've got a fuse, man. I'm trying to make plays here. Yeah, that guy deserves to die. My dude. Oh. He missed. Dude, I thought he was going to come over and swing at me there. <laughs> oh, you know what? He could probably have seen me, though. This is an issue because the objective I was trying to do, the fucking family come over to it. I think uh, there's a killer there. <clears throat> I'm just trying to get at the fuse box. I think the Leland opened it up, so. Let's attempt it. I have no... What? How the hell do you do this? Dude, I have no idea how to do this. Math? What? Match the round fuse color with the correct slot, ensuring that amp value is met for each pair. Once completed, power will be restored. The basement exit will open temporarily. 
Okay, so he won seven amps, so like five and two. Uh, and three and one. I did it. Okay. Um, question is, what's the fastest way down here? Because I have I haven't got a fucking Scooby Doo. Bro, don't tell me Bubba's down here. I think it was over this way. I'm just gonna fucking run for it. I think it was over this way, though. It's there! Fucking run! 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 Yes! Yes! We did it! Ah, oh, let's go! That is satisfying. My, I tell you what, they like to make this game really fucking difficult for you. Like, having to try and memorize where that fucking door was that just opened as well. After I just... <laughs> after I just stealthed that shit in order to get that as well. Like, stealthed it like a pro. That was a good win. Especially since I had Cook on my ass. I was, I was I was a stealth stealth pro that game. I got hit once or twice, I think. They really want you to know the map, yeah. I just I kinda just pictured it in my head. I was like just running that general direction, you'll see a green light. <laughs> yeah, okay, so the fuse one is kinda difficult as well, because you I mean not that math is hard or anything, but you kind of got to um, set that off and then run down the stairs, but... Wait, what's happened? Hang on, I'll back out. Do I try and... Uh, is Con still here? I don't know if he is. Probably don't be. Oh, I can't search for a game. Or is it already searching for a game? Oh, there we go. The generator one does seem the easiest, yeah. The, the valve one's a bit weird as well, because you kind of open it up and then when you get upstairs and you've got to wait for it to still open. Wait till the fucking sweats come on full launch and ruin the game. Oh uh, yeah, you know that's going to happen. Uh, we'll play a game as family. That, that was some good, uh, some good survivor games we had there though. The highlight one was definitely when I knocked Hitchhiker on his ass and ran out the gate. <laughs> that that game there, I did some good strategizing with Leland. Doing the fuse box is going to be super tough under stress. It's because it's not like in a well-hidden area either, so it seems like an area that can be easily patrolled and looked at. Seems like the most boring. Yeah, he's. I mean, he is the support of the of the team. I don't mind playing him though. I keep getting Cook and uh, Leatherface. I don't really get much for Hitchhiker. Skins with Bubba got leaked for the game, and it is is coming on on game launch. Oh, they actually add some skins at launch as well. <clears throat> yeah, so how you have like is there gonna is there gonna be multiple killers for each role? Other than like Leatherface, obviously. So like you're gonna have different support killers and different like I don't know proximity killers, I guess. I am metal metal man. Gonna use flip flop. Each killer is unique. Oh, okay, so they all have their own class. Let <clears throat> me collect some blood. I don't play much of this map as the uh, as the killer, so.
This is definitely a popular door for the survivors. Oh, there's a fuse right by Grandpa. Interesting. I feel like I should collect a hundred blood, right? Before I start doing this, because I feel like this could just waste time. I can't do this myself. Ability on cooldown. I'm gonna look around for some blood. <laughs> Let me close this as well. Close this one. Yeah, I mean, it's it's trying to learn where to put the padlocks, like where's the best place. I mean, I thought I put one on, it's probably a good one. Yeah, closing these hatches will definitely be a good thing right now. I need some more blood for Grandpa. Man is dying from his sprinting. Really, like no blood over here. Oh, there's some. That one ain't gonna make it much further. Isn't there someone just here? Oh yeah, look, sneaky little bastard. Hey, Sonny. I seen you bleeding. What is... Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> he ran into me. I swung. Somehow my character missed with like a fucking aim assist or whatever the hell it was. And he just jumped into the well. So random, man. I'm gonna padlock this door as well. Yeah, like that'd be a good one to padlock. <clears throat> Ooh, some more blood. Bucket empty. Uh, someone's already collected that one. On there as well. Grab that one, I'll go feed him. I think. Just collecting blood. I do like how the killers sort of have their own objectives though, as well. Otherwise, like, you're kind of fucked. That's some more blood. A victim sandwich. <laughs> Nancy Thompson DLC. <coughs> Only Sissy and Johnny. Was that Josh or someone? No idea where Josh come from. Oh, that would've been funny if that was that sunny before. Alright, Grandpa, I got 80 blood for you. Take this now. It'll perk you right up. I should've upped my sensitivity. <laughs> the way he runs, oh. I it'd be cool though, like if you can get like different weapons for them and stuff. What do you want? Want me to follow you into the basement?
Grandpa is hungry again. I'm padlocking shit. Nobody need me at all. <clears throat> you know, I need I need to find the basement door in this. There's got to be a basement door like in this building. I can never find it. Oh shit! Someone escaped. I got a kill. Oh. Well done. Well, two died, one escaped. Oh. Last one's on me. I don't know what that swing was. Hitchhiker behind you, bro. <laughs> he just fucking let her run. Oh, the trap. Oh no, dude, you could have waited for me. We could have double hit her. Damn. Man, they did they did that valve shit quick. The the bubba. I blame the bubba that game. Today's episodes of Cribs Cool Show <laughs> Cool shows us how shows us his garden. <laughs> you mean cook? If three thousand two hundred twenty points, you sweat. Is it Amori for the family or is there an own special kill? Oh, I'm not I'm not playing this guy again, man. I don't mind playing him, I just don't I don't want to keep playing him all the time. I'd rather try and play someone else. I don't think I even played the Evil Dead game event. It's nice to get double spirit points and stuff, but... Worthless rewards in the end. There we go, I'm Leatherface. <clears throat> you know, the support so everything is your fault. Dude, I did everything I... Like, right though, I think. I blocked them off, I gathered blood for Grandpa. Come on, Connie, 1v1 me. Cow shed. Let's go. Yeah, I got I got my uh, support ash leveled up pretty nicely on the event. Just wish they wouldn't have done it over the weekend, like, or at least done it for like a week. You trying to play this, Cook? They didn't get my game. Need a spot for him. That's weird though, because we're both we'll both be on the Europe servers. They should just leave it on, yeah. At what what uh What's the downside of leaving it on? Yeah, super no I am. Dude, if you can't feed grandpa, trap the property, kill all the survivors, and file your, file your taxes and you're a worthless player. <laughs> oh, but there's, there's, the bubba just didn't really... I don't think he patrolled the basement well enough as well. Like... If he couldn't find anyone, he should have at least patrolled, like, the... The fuse... Or the, um... The gas tank.
Just noticed my hat. I bought it on uh, Saturday. <clears throat> I wanted a new cap. <coughs> Stranded Alien Dawn. What's that game? Hope his power is his chainsaw. Yeah. Uh, there's like a video tutorial, but yeah, the, you kind of just get thrown into the game. You you definitely need to watch like a YouTuber to like understand the game. I would say a lot easier. Like someone doing tutorial videos on like oh how to play a victim, how to do this, like in depth ones. Cause they I yeah they just. Throw you in the throw you in the deep end in this game quite a lot. Wait, is it a, your birthday today, Marcus? <clears throat> You're for a new warrior and hunter and some bug fixes before they give up on the game. There's so much they need to do though. That's the problem. I don't think time is on their side either. In fact, they're kind of acting like they just have all the time in the world. You forgot it was your birthday? Well, happy birthday, dude. Crash land on different planets to survive. Oh, okay. That does sound pretty cool. So weird I can't get in your lobby. What is weird is this lobby is like... So dead. Because people keep joining and leaving for... Absolutely no reason. Keep searching, Con. You can do it. <clears throat> I'll find a lobby game's dead. Well, I, when I played before, um, before stream, I was just like sitting here for about five minutes before we actually played. I was just like lobby simulator. Um, so I I only played the first day of the event on Evil Dead. I played a little bit afterwards, like off stream, but that was it. I, I haven't had time to game all weekend. That's been the problem. <laughs> been doing too much stuff. <coughs> no one's playing cause, probably because they think the beta is over. I mean, I hope they add roll queue or something because it's going to be a real issue if people are just going to keep joining and leaving because they don't get a player's lever face or something. <coughs> Show them who the real Bubba is. We've got like an invisible survivor on the other team. Life happens when you have little or no time for it, precisely. I was actually doing my classwork like a good student for once, so Evil Dead wasn't in my plans. See, there you go. Yeah, it says there's six survivors in here, but there's only... Uh, there's six people, but there's only five. I'm gonna back out. I think this lobby's like bugged or something. Your door fell off his hinges. Ouch, man. Is this the same lobby we were just in? <laughs> Robocop. Uh, game Pass Day 1, I think.
Let's get a game, people. Good lord. Will Pixels ever play another game of TCM? So weird you can't get in my lobby though, because it's not like uh it's full. <laughs> People keep joining and fucking leaving. Yeah, I think Game Pass is one of the best things you can do for your game, honestly. Plus it's an early payday for the devs because obviously Xbox will pay them for putting their game on Game Pass. So it's just a little bit more funding to support the game at launch as well. You don't like that? It's a 3v4. I was a bit skeptical at first because I was like, how is it, how is it like 3v4 going to work? Like, like how is the killer side going to work? But I can see how it does work where it's like one patrol in the basement and then, you know, one doing the house stuff and one doing the, the perimeter. You played three games of this and uninstalled. I wanted to like it, but it's just not your thing. I mean, I definitely prefer playing Victim, but it, it, it does feel a bit jarring as well in some some places of the game. Xbox puts stuff on Game Pass to try and compete with PS5. Good, good for me, though. You know what, dude? I, I, I pay for three years or a year worth of um, Xbox Live Gold. I buy Game Pass Ultimate and then converse my Xbox Live Gold for the year. The Game Pass Ultimate for a year. <laughs> so you get it all for a year for a low price rather than paying monthly for it. Man, I'll, I'll be back streaming Evil Dead tomorrow. I just want, uh... I need, I need the devs to come out and say, yes, we're gonna be doing this, you know? Because... The last few interviews, you're just thinking... Is the game done for? I was just going to be listening to our players like, okay, so <laughs> there's, no, there's no time skill there, you know. <laughs> Take the attention away from this. Oh, no, it's cool, man. I'm just... No, we're, we're, nothing happening in the game, so we might as well talk. <laughs> we're waiting to fucking start. I'll be asked going to play Inscription. <laughs> it just said you're playing TCM on my monitor. Farming Simulator. Been playing all weekend, been really fun. Hope save Yeah, it's fun. It is fun. I'm I just I hope it's gonna have some actual live server stuff. Wow, that guy who was sunny that we left at the last second. To play inscription. I mean maybe maybe Sabre were a bit uh scared of this game's technical test, I guess. But you know, no I suppose everyone I mean, majority of Evil Dead players are clearly on console at this point. Like, it's, PC players aren't really going to be playing Evil Dead when this is out, unless they don't get in the in the tech tests. Oh man, someone finally joined and ready it up, and then fucking someone else left. Don't you leave as well, Hitchhiker? Jesus Christ, man! What are these people doing? The gate. The the aim of this game and the fun of it is trying to get a fucking lobby, clearly. I know, seeing the, seeing the progression system is definitely something that's going to be the, the most intriguing for me. But yeah, cheesy what's it? It's not bad. <clears throat> I mean, I think the gameplay is really fun on this, on both sides.
I just, I just, just like I said though, like the, the fun of it has been learning the game as well. So once you learn everything, like how, how is the, the replayability going to be after that? Once you've learned like all the, oh, th this, doing this with this survivor's meta, like that type of thing. Like once, once all that comes to, once all that comes out into the public and the stuff for the game, it's like, how, how, how enjoyable is the game going to be from there? Well, hello, Mr. I marked this member for nine months as a ghost beater. My room smells like fish. <laughs> get some hypes for Marcus, please. Oh, it doesn't get delayed though. It shouldn't. I think I don't think the game will be that far away from being complete by playing this. There's definitely some stuff to need to work on though, but yeah, I don't think it's that far away. Yeah, the balance, I mean, I definitely think the, the killer side could be a, a bit stronger. I've, I've won way more games on the, on the family side than I have on this. This man was AFK. <laughs> That's crazy how like close you spawn next to their their spawn as Leatherface though. I noticed that when I was playing Victim, I was like, oh, the survivors that respawn in that room. He <laughs> DC'd. Did I just unlock that? I did a bad thing. Right, oh, I locked it again. I go back into the basement. Well, there's people out here. Those legal eagle battle royales. Concern noises. I should have fed grandpa that blood actually. Oh, someone here. Two clean hits. Ya yeah, boy. Where'd she go? We're going for the massive outplay. I just outplayed myself because I just ran into a fucking dead end, but you know. It's the problem with this fucking basement, it's a maze. Ah, my bubba's out of stamina. Dude, he gets his stamina back quick though. She dead. <laughs> Two kills for me. Feel the view in this game is claustrophobic. Oh, I know. I should go uh, feed grandpa though. Cause I got, I'm stacked for blood.
It was like the model from DVD. Yeah. Just to be fair. I mean, apart from his little chainsaw. <laughs> he has a little tiny green chainsaw. Oh, got a weird stack noise there. Grandpa is hungry again. Dude, I just fed him. It's all right. I collect just some more blooded grandpa. I'm just here. Might as well. Sounds of affection. Yeah, our gramps. Ooh, there's a door open over there. Grandpa fed. Fucking door opened up over here. Uh, it wasn't this one, because someone fucking. Someone locked it. Guy didn't. Oh no, he does. He does have it on. <clears throat> Turn off. No. That's weird though. Like, I know on the. I mean, it should be the other way around. So on the victim side, obviously green means go. But on the family side, it's like it's on red. So for me, it means that it's turned off, and the electric's not going through it. Bit weird. Hey -o. Destroy this. Where these guys are at. Am I going... I mean, I, I never know how to get in the basement from here. But I'll get back down at the basement. Or at least try to. There's a fuse here, though. Is the well. I just thought if I patrol the, uh... The gas tank, which is probably what they're gonna go for. Oh, I seen... Uh, I think that was a hitchhiker, right? I don't know if he's... Oh wait, oh, he's collecting blood. Let me go down. Go to the gas tank, maybe he's... <clears throat> like the down here, maybe he's doing that. Looking for it. Are you down here? Hello? Start cutting shit. Dr. Pepper strawberries and cream. Oh my god. Oh god. Hell no. I would not be drinking that shit. That sounds sickly as fuck. Uh the gas tank was back here. Hey, yeah, here it is. Uh, Bubba the power is just his chainsaw, so... I think if you rev it up enough, you can almost like one-shot someone. How did I not kill that bitch? I had a super weak. <clears throat> I don't know where she's gone. Sneaky.
Yeah, I was thinking she might have went in there. But I'm not sure. <clears throat> oh, I guess she bled out. I was gonna say, she had to be super weak. I think I, I, think I hit her three times. Oh, you fully right up the chance. So you're going to tank everything where you run a lot quicker. Ah. Well, I'll take my two kills. Thought I did a good bubba game there. How long can a game go on for? I mean, I was I was playing victim earlier and it lasted probably about half an hour almost. Nearly escaped. Nearly. Didn't quite didn't quite get that though. Yo, what's up, Ash? How you doing? Best thing for you in the world is tango. Always. Always drink the tangos. Oh, Leland again. My boy. I am doing good, yeah. What is the meta? <laughs> Life meta. <clears throat> Jedediah Sawyer. Just gotta call him Bubba. Water has always been meta. No, it's not much people hiding lockers and shit. Yeah. It's... Uh, I think it's... To be honest, I, d I don't think it's a bad play. Because when I was playing Family, someone hid in one and I pulled them out. And I pretty much missed the hit on them. Because they have like a sort of immunity window. To get away. Enjoying the game so far? I am indeed. Cinnamon, I'm allergic to cinnamon. Not really. Thanks for making me hungry. <laughs> we always talk about food in this stream, so. If he's, a, if he's a off put by food, just come in this stream. We'll make his, we'll make his crave it. Get down! I do definitely have his concussion. Definitely. Can use what? I'm guessing there was a bone shard there or something. Bubba's like right here. Oh, he's there. It'd be funny if we could um <laughs> pull off another fucking thing that we did that other game. That was hilarious, man. <coughs> He just sprinted into Bubba and knocked him on his ass. Well, stunned him. Then shut the door in his face. I hope this works. Oh, I found a little bit of health. Pixel's cake recipe. Can't handle my cake. It's too nice. Bro, why is it? Last game we played Survivor. Or Victim, what you want to call it. We found a shitload of fucking toolboxes. This one I can't find anything. More health. 
Doesn't hurt to have more health. I make, I do uh, homemade bagel pizzas. <clears throat> I get the tomato paste and then I uh, put some mixed herbs and olive oil in the paste, mix it around. Have a nice tomato, tomato sauce. Go on the bottom of my pizza. I gave you some heals. Toolbox over here. Can I use this? This dude is so loud when he's so yeah. Please, you do it. This dude's way too loud. <laughs> can I heal while she does that? Oh, I can. There you go. <laughs> she poured that on her toes. <laughs> Them toesies hurt. You know, pour some, uh, pour some stuff on it. <clears throat> We're all just grouped up. <laughs> tomato, tomato sauce. Sorry, I've got terrible slang. I know. I'm gonna I'm gonna be the aggro right now. He chases me. Didn't chase me though. Chop chicken. Is this door open? Oh it is. Get out of here. <laughs> I'm such a little troll. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> See ya boys! <laughs> Well, uh, he he was chasing the uh, the Connie, so I was like, "Oh, I'm gonna go help her out." So I ran up behind her and then uh, did that. This man really looking for me. I'm over here, man. Just pop up like, "Hello." What up, Bubba? Any goodies in here? I got a bit more health. Unlock tool. No, I don't think we need that right now. Oh yeah, we got the valve handle. Nice. Very good. Oh, it's outside. See, I find it, think this is a lot easier. Shit. Bubba's coming. I mean, getting the valve handle outside is definitely a lot easier than going back into the basement to do it. Dude, okay. He's having a tent room. <laughs> Gotta love jumping out the window. Did they um electrify this? Oh, they did. Ah, oh, bro, if I picked up the unlock tool, I'd have been alright. So yeah, I'll always let you know that's the next objective. Yeah. That bub is still over there looking for me. I did that. 
If I get an unlock tool, maybe it'll get out. There is a, there's an unlock tool in the shed, but Bubba's kind of like... It's much too quiet. They can't be far. Basement exit opened. Oh shit, they did the fuse. It's fine. I'm trying to do mine. Oh, Bubba, no. What are you still doing over here, bro? What are you doing over here, man? I'm gonna be leaving this area. Enough. Alright, I'm gonna go get the lock. Unlock tool. I'm gonna go pick the lock on the gate. Uh I'm going that way. I can, but this guy sucks for that. Quiet Leland. Yeah, I know. I'm keeping an eye on the heart meter, but I think it's fine. You know, it's annoying, man. Like, you get a yellow aura when that thing fucking closes, but you don't really get much of an aura that when it opens. Uh, so this guy's ability, um, you just run into them, like sprint, and then press it. So then you can... Knock them on their ass. You can stun Bubba with it as well, which I did before. Oh, there was an unlock tool right there. Fuck's sake. Didn't see that one. Ah, oh, Bubba's right there, man. Leave this area, bro. I'm not here anymore, okay? I haven't been here for like 10 minutes. Oh, he put the, the battery back on. Darn it. Oh my god, dude. I was thinking when I was going through that bush, I was like, I bet there's a fucking trap in here. Look how close I was to standing in it. Oh, he's coming back over here. Guy, there's no way you know I'm like still around here. What the hell? Yeah, fuck you. Sus. Sus. And Bubba patrol in places, eh? Bro, I don't get this dude, how he can just phase through fucking walls. Oh shit. Jump scare. Crazy. <laughs> you lose health every time you do that. I know exactly where I'm going right now if I can get there. Oh, he's put a fucking trap down. Of course. Get up. 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 Oh. Dude, I was so close to getting out. I fucking bubble. <laughs> that fucking bubble would not leave that area, man. He was obsessed. <laughs> what the fuck was that guy doing? I gotta back out. Seemed like he was enjoying that. Man, toxicity in a fucking technical test. Uh, I've already I've already escaped with Leland's. The only one I haven't escaped with, I think, is um is Ava. Oh Anna, sorry. I keep calling that Ava. Fucking Anna. My Leland escape early was fantastic.
I could have been. I, you know what? It's sad. I could have been long gone out of that game. I should have. I should have picked up the uh, the unlock tool instead of keeping the health, like uh, for the first time, and then switch the battery off and then just pick the lock and got out. It's annoying though, like the team literally repaired the fuse and stuff and it's just like... <laughs> it's kind of like they're doing their own separate game. And you don't really get much of an option to be like, oh now I need to sprint into the basement to get there. But yeah, I think this game's always worth a chance. If you guys, even if you guys are like on the fence about it, at least give it a chance. Like I, I was all in everyone else, like in the similar boat where everyone here, but we were like, uh, I don't know about TCM, you know, it looks like another Dead by Daylight or, you know, something. And I, I was always saying, I don't know about another hide and seek type of game, but <laughs> it's definitely like worth trying out for yourself. Oh, back is sunny. I, I make this guy look meta. I do. Every time I play him. <clears throat> I'm just that good with him. Yeah, I think Killer Clowns is definitely going to be more of like an arcade type of ASIM game. <clears throat> Noise as a weakened grandpa. I didn't make any noise, man. What are you talking about? Crazy how much the fucking noise jumps up when I do it. I'm holding that down as well. There we go. We got it. Oh, and a bit of health for us. Nice. The door right here is Bubba at. Uh, I think someone's on them stairs though. Shit. He's putting a trap down on them stairs, I think. So we can't really go out that way unless we have a bone shard. To disable his trap. Joe, we're gonna have to look for another way out. Chocolate who made the noise so you can trap them with the killers. <laughs> I like, yeah, so you can see where they are. The blood bathroom. Oh, nice, these guys just opened up one. Don't shut the door. What are you doing, Connie? Oh my god. He's such a such a silly goose. And Bubba's behind us, man. I'm hiding. <laughs> Burst out. I'm gonna use head on. Nah, man. I don't like this. Sneak out. Sneak out. It's fine. Just sneak out. I 
I've got like two killers sniffing around next to me, man. The fuck? Are right, they going back into the basement? Okay. All right. <clears throat> oh shit! He's right there. <laughs> <laughs> I keep forgetting they can actually look through the window. <laughs> Bro, there's no way he didn't see me. What? <laughs> oh, no. I gotta pick that lock. I don't wanna fucking pick it. Surely there's another way around. Please tell me there's another way around. We're not picking the lock. Shit. Well, that sucks. Pick that bitch. Faster, Sonny. Come on. I, I don't know, it was a bit weird, suspicious time and why they did that Spirit Point event, but maybe it's just because we all asked for one. But they actually decided to do it, so. Annoying as fuck, because I lose my... Lose my unlock tool. Now I need to go find another one. Hopefully, the shed had a couple last time, so hopefully we can get one and then get out over this way. Seriously, yeah, I mean, maybe he's not, but I really don't know. Hey, there we go, there's an unlock tool right here. Get hold of that. And then we can try and pick our lock over here. Cat won't even look at me, so I think you're winning. <laughs> Cat's eating toast. My cat does that. How weird, though. I... I've never known a cat to eat eat toast. Well, that set the- uh, shit. Well, he trapped the battery. Um... I'm the last person? Shit. Bro, what? Uh, so now you tell me. And I get fucking spotted off that? Hillary told me, like, after it fucking happened. Oh, man. Oh, here we go. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, swap that for hell. <clears throat> I got cooked. Oh, yeah, it usually comes up. Keep still to avoid detection. It's like, all right. Like... Bit late now, isn't it? Tell me that. Bloody game. Alright, so I'm gonna disable this trap. I'm gonna disable the battery. And I'm gonna pick the lock on the fence. And we out. We outie. That's my, that's my plan of attack. Whether it works? It's another fucking story. I just hope the hitchhiker doesn't come over here to check that I'm... Messing with this shit. Oh, why? I'm screwed. Okay. Five. My friends. 
I'm sorry, but it does not take this long to take a couple of fucking pliers off a, uh, of a battery. <laughs> Just get some rubber gloves, man. Instant. Instant. Go tell- Oh my god, he's got another trap down, chat. He's got another fucking trap down. Oh my god, man. You can, but you need a bone shard. This is why I have to go back over here. This guy is making my life difficult. Hopefully by the time I don't do this, he's put a, fucking the battery back on. See if I knew he had another trap down, uh, I would have got the, the tool last this time. Sure he doesn't want to get shocked. Just grab that bitch by the horns and just clench them clench them cheeks. You can you can handle it. But if I get out of here, big plays. I definitely piss I definitely probably picked the fucking hardest objective to get out from though. I'll say that. Definitely. And disabling two traps to get around this shit. Oh. The stress, chat. The stress. Oh wait, I didn't even need a lockpick for that. Are you fucking serious? You just need to, you just need to turn the battery off. I thought you had to pick the lock on it. Oh well. Another another escape with Sonny. People keep calling them terrible. I escaped from the rear exit. See your chumps. Hey, Bubba got three kills that game. My teammates did terrible. <laughs> they did. They did fucking terrible. They did absolutely nothing. Nah, to be honest, they opened up the door for me to get out. Like that keeps flashing last man standing multiple times. <laughs> Also, if your condition is deteriorating, what are the odds that you actually survive running down the road to get help? Oh no, as soon as you leave, uh, you don't deteriorate anymore. That's just how... How being in a blind panic works. Video title is Sonny actually met. Dude, I've got two escapes with this guy now. I'm proud of it. That'll be a third. Oh man, I need to charge my watch. <laughs> I can't believe not one of them came over to check that battery, though. After all that time. And I even got detected. By Grandpa, because of some weird glitch. Like, people disconnecting or something. She looks hot. <laughs> Honey simp. Oh, I found the... Shit, 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 shit. Bubba's right there, man. You don't see me, Bubba. Come on, bro. He does. I found the, the gas tank, which is good. I think there'd be something on this table. It's bone shard.
women in the 70s were kicked. <laughs> I don't like when people are sprinting behind me, man. It gets me fucking paranoid because Bubba's right there. I don't think he's revved his chainsaw up. <clears throat> oh shit. Fuck's sake, man. Like, how have I ended up in this situation? Because I've done nothing but play stealth. I think they're gone. Nah, man. I see him. I need to be more quiet. Are you fucking shitting me, dude? You lucky bastard. Sorry, I'm gonna dead hard him, chat. Bro, is there like any crawl spaces anywhere? Shit. Let me just hide here real quick. Oh, bro. Bro. <clears throat> you can't hide in car in car trunks. No, I picked some health up before, but didn't grab it for some reason. Not sure why. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Hi Kate. I think there was health over here, wasn't there? Oh, what the fuck, dude? Where's this guy coming from? Yeah, uh, Leland, can you, you fancy stunning that guy behind me? He's on my ass. What the fuck? Oh my god, man. This dude just won't leave me alone. I don't know how to get away from him. He's just always behind me, man. No! Fuck. Oh. Try to shut that on the other side. I just accept my fate, chat. It's, it, it's super fucking annoying, though, because I'm playing really stealth, okay? And then I'm just seeing people sprinting full on behind me and stuff. And then all of a sudden I've got the like three killers fucking chasing my ass. I had Bubba. I had fucking Hook at one time. And then I had Hitchhiker down in the basement fucking chasing me. Like what the hell? Meanwhile, these people are just fucking sprinting around. Not getting chased at all. While, I, while I'm being stealthy as hell. Certainly annoying. I did. <laughs> I had the whole family tree on my ass. Like, I don't, I don't understand if I was making noise and stuff, bro, but fuck me. You just realized something? What? Best time to play this game is during the day, because... It's set during the day, so that just creeps you out even more. I'm gonna step outside, there's gonna be a fucking hitchhiker waiting for me with his little knife. 
go, go to the corner shop, there's going to be a fucking old man with his snapped broomstick waiting to attack me. Oh, guys, he's so dirty, bro. The mark was simping for Anna. It could, it could be more worth it to go fast A to B rather than sneaking around. I know, like. This is why I can't wait for the progression system, like what type of perks we're going to be able to unlock, like, you know, getting their extra stamina and stuff. Does anyone know what these, like, little, uh, little spoon things are above the names? Whatever the fuck that is. Like, I have a one. The guy has seven. Is that, like, how many escapes they've got? It's the seventies Burkarama. We forgot today was Monday, I'm so tired. What are you not tired, Kate? This was the style in the seventies. Okay, so you can kind of fill the bar up quite a lot <laughs> before you actually make noise. Good to know. Don't tell me I'm going to have Bubba on me at the start because of that. Hey, I'm not here, Bubba. Bubba is cutting a door down right behind me. Fuck off, dude. Are you kidding me? Like, why is this man randomly chopping down fucking wooden doors? bad. I always forget I have to stand still. That was that was literally my fault though. Oh I'm the Sunny. Are you? Wait, you actually in my game? I was gonna say, <laughs> Tony Khan actually got in my game. I think this map seems a bit harder. I don't know. Like, for the escape points and stuff. Fuck me, dude. How do I keep ending up with Bubba behind me? Like, just out of nowhere. Why is he even up here so early? Fuck hell. He couldn't make it up. 
Why is this door highlighted yellow? Did oh, this guy just get up here? Bubba needs that Anna ass. <laughs> he just he keeps coming out of nowhere. Like, I'm like, what the fuck, dude? I'm always being very sneaky as well. It's not like I'm making loads of noise, am I? <clears throat> At least I hope I'm not. Pardon me. This guy got a lock. Yeah, he does. Okay. May you try and find a fuse. Really leave? I don't know about this. Uh, so she can take extra damage with her ability. So you have to activate it just before you get hit. <clears throat> you don't take as much damage. Oh shit. I hope this guy didn't see me. <coughs> Yeah, there's a valve there. Shit. I found the valve, but... Yeah, I think they heard that guy by the fuse. Ooh, they didn't hear me, though. I'm going for a chat. Okay, it's down there. And there's a well right here. Um okay. go 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 go. Should be able when you're in the basement to put a mattress down, so when you fall into the well it takes no damage. You take no damage. Okay. Well, at least I know where this is straight away. Be super sneaky. I know they're still around here somewhere. Be careful, Anna. And that like that. Let's go. Alright, now we need to try and make a back upstairs. See, this is the problem. I can never remember what fucking door we opened up. What we do is we open up a fucking door and get out of here. Wait, what's that? I'm so fucking lost right now. I know, but the the gate's opened and I do, I can't fucking get out of here. Cause I, I, I can't I can't find the fucking exit doors, man. So annoying. Uh, I found the fuse one. But it's like I just haven't seen a normal fucking door. You know. How long does that stay open though with the gas pressure? Yeah, bro, it's just like. Cook has heard you. Oh, he's just let me right here this whole time. Cool. <clears throat> there we go. Ah, uh, see, it's just shut. Oh, finally. Oh, I finally found the fucking. Oh, that was open and it shut. So someone, someone got killed at the exit, I think. 
I know, I know how to open up the fuse. I opened up that exit though, that's the annoying thing. But I couldn't find the fucking... Uh, I couldn't find the door to get out of the basement because it's just a fucking maze down there. There's no way this guy knew I was here, man. What? What? came straight over to me. Oh, I've got a lockpick that. Yeah, no thanks. This man just ran out of stamina. <laughs> Shit. Bro, what? Cook has heard you. Do I have anyone left on my team? I think I do. Someone. <laughs> she's she's not as good as Sonny for hiding. Definitely not. Got one guy left. Problem is, is I can't find a fuse anywhere upstairs. I'll try and repair that as well. I found another valve that we could attempt that again. Loud ass doors need some WD-40 on it. Be too rusty. You can do this. Think. You can do this. What's that, over there? that is some more health, which I will take. Thank you very much. And poured on my ass. There we go, back to full health, chat. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Alright. Oh shit, Grandpa is right here. Fuck me, dude. I did not know that. Why is this fucking cook coming randomly over here? Come on, man. Oh, this door's not fucking unlocked. Nice. Fucking run, please. Please, just run. Fucking hell, man. I go up there for a second, I'm just, you know, Grandpa's like... That's so bad though, like, Grandpa being right by a fucking exit. Out of the basement. Just like, instant detected. Thank you. He's heard me. Oh, nice. Oh. I don't think we're making it out of this one, man. I don't know what the other survivor's up to, but... Yeah, we kind of fucked. <gasps> no way. No way, no way, no way. This dude just fucking saved my ass. What a, what a legend. What an MVP fucking Sonny is, man. I need to see if he makes it out. I hope he does. What a fucking legend this guy is. I mean, I, I give him the freedom to do shit like that. <laughs> Just ran by him as well. Nice. Yeah, that dude carried my ass there. 
Although, again, I had like all three family members, apart from Leatherface, there fucking chasing me down. I had this guy at me on the start, though. Sonny really is S tier. Fucking MVP, man. The fact that just opened up right in my face, like, you couldn't, like, it's just such perfect timing. Alright. I'm gonna call it there, guys. It's been fun checking this game out, though. Oh, yeah. We, we should do some videos like that, right? Some clickbait. Hey, Sonny is actually meta. Don't listen to other content creators. We discovered over here that he is meta. Oh, man. But I'm, I'm, I'm fucking... I'm, I'm starving. I need to get some food. I might, I might play a little bit off stream as well. Yeah, it's been, it's been a fun experience playing this. I still don't know what side I like to play more of because the family is fun, but I love, I kind of love the suspense that victims get in, especially when you, once you understand the objectives a bit more. I tell you what, it's just a total fucking headache trying to remember where doors are and stuff on this game though. Yeah, I wasn't expecting to get any escapes today and maybe he's one but to be honest i got quite a few and and some of them were really funny and clutch which i enjoyed both sides look fun survivor is a little more frustrating but still fun yeah it definitely is but hey august it's out not too long away but we'll be back on evil dead tomorrow till then um but yeah i appreciate you all hanging out hope you've enjoyed the gameplay i certainly did it was a lot of fun uh, to check out a different game for once. Uh, but I, I'll be back tomorrow for Evil Dead stuff. I'll see you all then. Hope you all have a good night and whatever you're doing. I'll catch you next time. Take care. Have a good one. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Effects are magical. I dub thee Pixie Broth. <laughs>